Hey folks, this is Ranker, and welcome to the Diablo 3 Season 30 Waiting Room. Hope everyone is doing well today. It is Friday night, hope you all had a fantastic week. Kiskaloo, 96 month, oh resub. Can we believe it's been eight, eight long years? Has it been eight long? Has it really been eight years? Wow. Yeah, I guess that, that math tracks. Look at that. <laughs> Eight long years going east. Always east. Always to the east. Love you, Kisk. Hope you're doing well. And do not gift a sub to Blazing Sweetloaf. And I'll see you do not. Also gift a sub to Tox Mod. Hope you're doing well, Denaria. Yeah. We also had Leroy McGee a little earlier. New sub via Prime Gaming. Welcome. Thank you. J How 96 month resub as well. Been here been here all along, like like Sombra in the dark. Ah, J How. Miss you this was gone. We'll have to we'll have to find another way to meet up now. Uh hope everyone's doing well on uh, YouTube and on Twitch. So um season 30, man. Here we are. We said last season was the last season of D3. Technically, I mean, seasons aren't going to end. Last season was the last season with a new theme. Season 30 now, we're getting a repeat of uh, a past theme. But we also got a massive balance patch that has put the game into an exceptional place. I recently put out a tier list video on the best builds. I put that up like yesterday, I think. So we go over where things all lie now. What are the best builds? What is the meta? What is the tier list? But... I think this is the last season with a significant patch. Like, I think now we are going... Season 31 will be full-on maintenance mode. Possibly not even any balance changes anymore. And just rotating in past seasons. So, if you didn't catch it... Altar of Rights coming back into the game permanently in nerf form. Wow, 14 months. That is more than a year. Not for, um... Non-seasonal, for whatever reason, it's only being added to seasonal play, but it'll be there every season. Along with the Visions of Enmity, that was the Season 29 theme. Lilith Bathory, 14 months. That is indeed more than a year. Appreciate you, Lilith. Duna gifted another, another sub to Vizzy. Merci, Duna. And Old Geek Gamer, 3-month resub. Hope you're doing well. Duna gifted a sub to Punkers. Thank you so much, Duna. Um, and yeah, the season coming back, the theme is Soul Shards from season 25. So big power buff on average about two tiers, for, but it's for everyone unilaterally. So, you know, some are a little under, some are a little over, which sees some movement in the tier list as well. And we are T minus 27 minutes from season start. So if you're watching the VOD of this and you just want to wait, you want to skip ahead to the season start, 27 minutes is when season officially starts. Past Tiger, 77 month resub. Hope the family is doing well. Duna giving a sub to Angel. Thank you, Duna. And Punkers dropping a five sub, sub bomb. Thank you so much, Punkers. Dang. You guys, you guys. I guess, so yeah, uh, today is my, or recently is my my what streamer anniversary my partner anniversary on twitch thank you for all the wishes everybody what is the exact date do we know the exact it's not exactly today it can't be coincidentally exactly today that would be insane if it was literally today on the season start of, th of season 30. we got a hype train going on twitch we are 26 percent of the way to hype train level two with four Minutes on the clock, sub gift for these bits to get to the next level. Everyone who participates unlocks the special hype train emotes. Appreciate y'all. And dude, and there you are, 93 mile three sub. Just when I just when I thought it was out, he pulls me back in. Yeah, we got Just when I thought I was out, he pulls me back in. We got the gang together for uh for season 30 here. Hook Pikachu. Oh, Pikachu. Jonathan Kajit. How many wares do you have? I have coin for you. I have right coin. Appreciate you. Jonathan, 34% of the way there. Hmm. 
Meanwhile, how are our, uh, how are our YouTube folks going here? Peter Lorenzon, how you doing? Excited for Ethereals to come back permanently. Ethereals are not coming back permanently, Kyle Jamer. I, I, not that I've heard, but they will rotate in with one of the season themes at some point, for sure. So same with Soul Shards, right? It's, it's the season theme for this theme, but it's not a permanent part of the game. Unless y'all have heard something that I haven't heard. Ah, yeah, Frenzy Bar, Big Boon, for sure, yeah. My pet reminds you of Danny DeVito. Little little Diablo. Little Danny D. <laughs> De De Pablo. <laughs> oh, man. So Visions of Enmity was the theme where these portals are going to pop up in adventure mode outside of rifts. And they take you through these levels that are really rewarding to do. You get a ton of mats. Now, if, if you want to do them while leveling 1 to 70, when you're super low level, they're very challenging. I would wait to be... Maybe around level 20 or so. You can kind of get away with it. If if you get some like good items, right? If you kick yourself out a little earlier than that, you can be okay. But yeah, they drop so many crafting materials. And uh, it's just a new way to farm stuff that gives you an alternative to doing other things. Like, uh, you know, running rifts and bounties to get GR keys and such. Hello, Naomi. How you doing? Is there solo cell found this season? No. How do you get soul shards again? That's a good question. Jeez, it's been a while. Um, I think you farm them off bosses, don't you? Yeah, you gotta like farm them off bosses. Do you still start with a challenge rift or go straight into the? Uh, uh, I'm I'm gonna be starting with the challenge rift. Absolutely. Now, that said, the game has become incredibly easy now with all these various ways of powering up, but I'm going to be starting with the Challenge Rift. I mean, regardless of whether you use the Challenge Rift or not, you might as well start with the Challenge Rift. But you wait for the season to start. Do not do the Challenge Rift yet, folks. Wait until season officially starts before doing your Challenge Rift. There is Solo Cell found? Oh, wait, you, wait. Hold on. There is Solo Cell found. When you say there's solo cell found, there's solo leaderboards. Am I blanking on something? Have I not been paying attention to D3? Did they add solo self found? There's always been solo leaderboards. I know that Max Roll had at some point a solo self found like a self-policed solo cell found mode, but that wasn't in the game. You can select solo cell found when you create a character. Is this as of last season? Yeah, look at that. Solo cell found. All right. Ah. So this was uh, a season 29 edition then, was it? Last season. There you go. All right. Solo cell found permanently in the game. There we go. <laughs> Happy Harmonies, hope you're doing well. well. Muffin, what's going on? Hey, cheers, Niyota chan Luyunan, how you doing? Oh yeah, last box looking great. Looking great, absolutely. Hey, nice, big cats cards. Oh, you're too kind. For the new season of D4, do we start with no resources, potions, and gold? Um, It's whatever season 2 started with. So there's no changes to what we start with, so... You do begin, you don't start with the gold that you have, but you start with the any progress that you made in, like, like hopefully by now you've completed your Renown, and that will still, the tier 2 of the Renown still carries over. So the bottom tier, like where you get the, the, um, the Paragon points and everything. Oh yeah, all about that last Epoch hype, for sure, for sure. Yeah, thank you for the happy uh, anniversary wishes, everybody. And I did not get my Shaco, but I'm fine with that. I'm done with the D4 season until season 3. It's right around the corner at this point. Not even 
death can save you from me. You have 20 minutes to order a poutine go go go. <laughs> Merci Duna. <laughs> Thanks Duna. <laughs> yeah, maybe uh, maybe we'll go after stream or something, yeah. <laughs> I just had a nice, uh, a nice supper though. I'm nice, uh, I'm nice and full to keep me through the rest of uh, the D3 night. Then I got to do the news video for tomorrow, so that's gonna be fun. Happy New Year! Hope you all have had a great start to 2024. The last blast begins. I like it. I like it. Seattle says Happy New Year. Right, right back at you. I'm doing well, Lilith. Hope y'all are doing great. So I'm going to be going Monk. I'm going to rebirth one of my two Elbereths. Is there a new D3 season? There is. It begins in 19 minutes on NA and it began like nine hours ago on EU. Looking for Bale. Man, that first Duriel, man. Everyone remembers their first Duriel because they had to change their pants after that. Uh, Doma saying, no, really, man. D4 Season 3. The teaser shows gears. Think about it. The cube has always looked like steampunk. We get in a cube. That would be really cool. I never saw the cube as a steampunk contraption, though. I don't know. I'd be cool. I would like that. But I never saw the, the Harantra cube or Kanaya's cube as any kind of steampunk thing. It was always very, like, just magic-oriented for me. I can't remember any discernible cog gear or anything steampunky looking on that. I don't see action. In fact, I don't think I don't think anything really is steampunk in Diablo, or very little at least. You can argue maybe the demon hunters contraptions like are kind of steampunk ish, maybe. I think the fact that we didn't hear any of the gears spinning. It felt like something was missing there, uh, but we did hear that like ticking. So I think something about clockwork mechanisms is going to be very important. Jokes on Jerry, I don't wear pants. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> oh man. Why is the D4 season three teaser featuring GGG's logo intro? Well, in fact. <laughs> It's not a D, it's not a it's not a season three teaser. It's a teaser of for for Poe two. Evil looms. They're they're scared of Poe two. Oh yeah, Doma. <laughs> Put up a side by side picture. Angel saying, I don't trust that it's your last time on D3. I mean, it would be nice if it's not. If if I get pulled back again, hey, I'm fine with that. <laughs> I didn't think I'd be coming back for this one. But the timing was just right, you know? Like, I'm done with the D4 season. Next D4 season starts you know, on the 23rd. So, what, a week and a half, barely? So, stream some D3 tonight and we'll take it from there. I don't know if you ever played Destiny or Destiny 2, but the community had a looking for group website that connected the majority of the community. Does Diablo 4 have a site like that? Do you know? Nope. Uh, there are Discord channels, but nothing officially supported by the game. Uh, we have a Discord channel, discord.gg slash Riker, if anyone wants to connect uh, and play various games together. You could do so. If Iron Rose casts Blood Nova, why is that skill put on the bar? If Iron Rose casts Blood Nova, why is that skill put on the bar? I don't know the answer to that, Muffin. And I also don't fully understand the question. Why is that skill put on the bar? I don't think the Iron Rose does anything to change your skills. It shouldn't... It, I don't think any item in Diablo 3 will change what is on your skill bar. I 
I think it's contingent on you having, like, you have, you yourself have to have it on your skill bar. So, Iron Rose. Attacking with Siphon Blood has a chance to cast a free Blood Nova. Yeah. Oh, are you asking... Okay, I understand the question. You're asking, why do we bother putting Death Nova on our bar if we're getting the free casts? Because we don't want to rely on that. Ten with the raid. Thanks for the raid, Ten. I hope you're doing well. Appreciate ya. So, yeah, it, it's it's because we don't want to just sit and channel to trigger our, our, our Novas. We want to be able to actively do them, from what I recall. Yeah, uh, so these also don't benefit from area damage. Any skill that you do not actively trigger does not benefit from area damage. What's this about PlayStation price hikes, uh, Doma Orn? Chicken Plucker, new sub. Welcome. Appreciate you. You also got a barb named Freya? Nice. I'm going to be going Monk this season. Thanks, Casual Gaming and Angel. Which Death Nova build is the best this season? Inarius. But it's super close. Technically, yeah, you can argue that the no-set version is just as strong, but it's so much more difficult to gear. Like, just go Inarius. So I think this pet was acquired from, like, a past BlizzCon, so I don't think it's possible to get it anymore, unfortunately. I'm give my record puts in budget to sell. <laughs> oh, nice doing that. Reacting last Saturday, I watched someone stream who hasn't streamed in like 10 months, and somehow the day was exactly her partner anniversary, so I wouldn't be surprised if today was actually yours. But did she do that on purpose, though? Curious is going to be fighting the real Trion, the true three prime evils, bad internet, connection to bad. To surfers, bad weather outside, the unholy trifecta of evil ISPs. Oof. Oof. NA servers, yeah. I will indeed be going with in a build, yes. PlayStation Plus Essential from $60 to $80. Oof. PlayStation Plus Extra from $100 to $135. And Premium from $120 to $160. Yikes. I don't know, so I I am a recent console adoptee. I don't even know that I can really call myself a console gamer. Like we own we have multiple consoles in our household. We rarely ever play them. I do technically have D4 on you know on PlayStation. I have played it a bit uh in the summer. I don't know how console gamers ever accepted having to pay a fee to play games over the internet. Like, imagine if we had that on computer, where, like, like, you're paying for your internet, and then you also have to pay, like, Microsoft to be able to play games on your Windows PC over the internet. Like, it's just crazy to me. <laughs> so it's, it's, like, you're, you're paying for your internet, and then you also have to pay PlayStation to play games over the internet. Like, what the heck, man? It's crazy. It's crazy. Big Cat's card saying, Gamer-based protein slash nutrition bar is called Skill Bar and follow up with some pre-workout BS called Skill Slot. No need to pay me. <laughs> I like it. I like it. I see Alberth looking good in her armor. I don't think that's fair. Whenever I dress like that, all I hear is stop and oh God and call the police. <laughs> oh man. Sam Gamgee the Monk. 
Good old Samwise Gamgee. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I will be cashing in my first Challenge Rift cash. Yeah. So, if you think you will play at least 15 hours between the time that season starts and the time that the Challenge Rift cash resets on Monday... Right, more than twenty, more than fifteen to twenty hours of play, then it is worth saving your cash for the altar of rights. If you're not going to be playing that much over the weekend, then it, you're better off just using it right away. So I'm going to be using it right away because I don't see myself playing beyond tonight, and I'm not playing for fifteen hours tonight. Soul shards sound like very powerful, unpleasant wet farts. You know, they're not too dissimilar to that. Slayer gift in the sub. Thank you so much, Slayer. Ten minutes behind chat. Season starts at eleven. Okay. All right. All right. We gotta. We gotta zoom zoom up through chat here. Uh, also, where where's my gang? Where's my gang? I'm gonna. I gotta join. So we got dude, Greg, and Curious. Okay, they're already. Are they already set? Gentlemen. How are we doing tonight? Doing well, doing well. How about yourself, sir? Doing well, doing well. I mean, why were you late today? Uh, I don't want to start the stream an hour early and have an hour of, like, doing nothing until stream starts. You can ramble. I could. You've seen it. Yeah, well, I mean, that's just a regular stream, right? But and this is why. I didn't want to make it just a regular stream. It's the season start stream. You could you could have one hundred percent brought up the Riker chalkboard and started doing some drawings. This is very true. But then I would fall yeah. behind on chat. Then I'd have like too much chat to oh. catch up on. Yeah, like you already you ain't already done that. <laughs> You're over fifteen minutes behind on chat already. <laughs> oh god, yeah. I'm caught up on YouTube. I'm not caught up on Twitch. Um, is Greg a little low for you? I I turned him up a little bit. Yeah. I got him at double. I got him maxed out. And I think he might I still be low for people. But I got a minute. Probably just my microphone volume. Let me kind of mess around with it. Roger, you're, you're good, dude. Do you think they will change up the strongholds at all? Uh, I like them, and they have pretty good lore. But I feel like it will get tiresome after a while. Um, so strongholds in D four are super fun. Like I think they're a really really cool thing. I hope they do more with them. Um, because it's like, it, it, right now it's just something you do one time, right, at the start of a season. If, if, you know, if even that, you don't even do all of them. Uh, and then you don't really touch them again. So, I, I think it'd be cool if they do something more with them. I don't know what, but something. That isn't just like, oh, they periodically, like, unthing and you gotta, like, uh, unconquer and you gotta reconquer them. Scratch, Bob, it's saying I look positively exhausted. I am, yeah. Uh, it's been a <laughs> long night, uh, and, um, another long night ahead of me. So pumping out videos and such. Hey, cheers. Azra Khan. Uh, Tearless is accurate. Yes, Tuna. Yes. That's, uh, that's, that's what I go by. It's going to release on February, better. Angel. Don't worry. It's going to release. Yeah. Was that, Greg? Does that sound a little bit better? It does, yeah. All right, cool. Chat, what do you say? Is Greg, uh, is Greg volume 5x5? Five five? Just need to say the correct words. You just need legendary. <laughs> you see, I'm officially turning you down. We've I'm officially we've, turning we've, you down right now. We found a tactic now that will make us no longer feel legendary envy because we're gonna unlock item requirements at like immediately. So we're gonna craft ourselves a bunch of level seventy gear. So we won't even need the stinking legendaries. <laughs> Legendary Ooh. traps. It's like, oh yeah, that'll nerf me by like you know six hundred percent. Cool. <laughs> Although by the same token, we're gonna hit level seventy in like an hour max, and then we will want the legendaries, and then Greg's luck is gonna <laughs> still. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> yeah, catch up them. Appreciate you, scratch. T minus five minutes, folks. T minus five minutes. As a reminder, don't do the challenge rift until the season starts. Um. So I think we can party up preemptively. We normally kill the uh, client and reload it. Yeah. When we do it. So. Oh, right. Okay. So wait, is the plan then to just it. remake the game? I'm thinking. I'm thinking. Of, I'm literally thinking of just 
logging out 100 percent until start that yeah, it seems like yeah. that's been the theme the past 10 seasons right yeah every time saying... i have too much faith in the servers yeah, it's like definition of insanity. We keep doing the same thing, expecting a different result. No, this time we're changing it up. Oh, they got it this season, damn it. This Smarter will be the one. Than they this. finally got it. No. That's the season theme. The seasons of the servers behave well for the first five minutes. Yeah, they go into maintenance mode and now they work. Uh-huh. Yeah, that's right. Uh, yeah, so that's exactly what our strategy is going to be. So we're going to go to Tristram immediately to the... To, to the um, the event, the anniversary event, run down to level five to grab those gems because those gems are what we need to get our altar upgraded enough that we can then remove all level requirements from gear. So then we just craft ourselves a level 70 gear. We set the game to T6 and we are balling. This was season 25 or 26? 25 soul shards coming back, exactly. Yeah. yeah. I was like, I remember doing this back in the day, a long time ago. Good you do, because I don't back. remember doing it. <laughs> I actually I kind of forgot. I think we got to farm them from the bosses, but that's that's like a problem to deal with in like two hours. Yeah. Figure that no, out then. <laughs> yeah, so the Soul Shards uh, I, uh, dropped from... I posted it in chat someplace from the official website. Or Wonderful. I'm sorry, from the official maxroll.gg leveling guide. No, it's official. Chicken plucker, how yeah. you doing, man? Soul shards drop from adventure mode bosses. There you go. All right. You saying I still think both the tweet and the replies on it from the Diablo account don't fit Blizzard's character? Yeah, they got all kinds of fresh blood on uh, doing the socials. I don't know if you've been paying attention to the D four socials in general. Like they, it's it's been a whole other tone from from the past. It's worth saying I've always been with season characters with the Roman numerals of the season number at the end. This makes season thirty rather spicy. Oh, XXX. I wonder if it's even going to be allowed. You you won't be able to name your character that. About to find out. All right, T minus two minutes. Um, I'm blazing through chat here on Necro Iron Rose. Right, okay. So, uh, Muffin, I think I think we addressed the question. You still want to be manually casting it for more damage. When you're doing speed runs, you generally won't need to. But when you're when you're pushing up against high difficulty uh, things, you're going to want to pump out the extra deeps. Good morning, Slayer. Here's the medicine POE. Nice 10. Good evening, damn straight gaming. Do you think DMO Frozen Rubble will be good for 150 group farms? It is like a D or a C tier build. Is it viable? Yes. It's going to be significantly weaker than alternatives, though. Like, if you're not running Meteor, you're going to fall behind. But it's, it's viable. It's viable. The people that, you're, that are running with you, you know, are fine with it. Check your Twitter for Barna Tweed during stream. Should know. Oh, wow. What a coincidence, Ryok. Wow. Wow. What season was Shadow Clones? Oh, I have no idea. Shadow Clones. That was a while ago. Less than one minute here. It's going to be crowded at the start. Is this a hot season? Is this a more popular season than season 29? They don't have a lot of uh, competition right now. That's fair. That's fair. DOE's mid league. D4's down. I mean, eh. True. I got a Switch too, Tan, yeah. Barely used it as well. <laughs> Thanks a lot, yeah. Busy on week, I'm going to open the cash now. Wait till Monday to get the other one. There you go. There you go. We don't know anything about Season 3 apart from that weird teaser with the clockwork gear mechanism. Right, Jared. Yeah, it's it's bittersweet. It's kind of crazy to think, you know, like it's, we've we've had uh, eleven years of D three now. Eleven years I've been playing this game, and apparently streaming for eight. Apparently, at least eight. Yeah, no, eight eight makes about sense. Watching watching the game. Am I gonna ever wear a a handmade hoodie with my R on it? It's too hot in my office to wear. I barely want to wear anything with long sleeves. I would be sh like, I'm normally shirtless. Like, I'm just generally too hot in 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 my environment. I put on a shirt just for stream and videos. <laughs> and even that, like, I am sweating. It's winter in Canada, and I am sweating in my office, and I have no heat on.
test number 3000. Can you hear me now? Ah, yes. Five by five. Super clear. Nice. Beautiful. Has the season not... Ah, <laughs> as I say that. All right. So remaking the game. Because I don't trust that. Restarting game. I guess we'll create heroes while you're restarting. Girlfriend and I have run out of games and we were thinking about playing an RPG like Diablo out of all the ones that have played. Which one has the best campaign and combat? Not PewDiePie too complicated. Diablo 4. I know it's the unpopular answer right now, but if you're talking just campaign and combat. I would say D4. If you're asking which has the best end game and like itemization, not D4. Alright, so I'll rebirth. Rebirth solo? No, rebirth. Also can confirm you can put XXX in your name. <laughs> oh my. Alright, so we're gonna leave it at uh level one difficulty, but I'm gonna start inviting you guys. Dude Greg Curious. All right, and we are going to do L Challenge Rifter, which is a Jade Dog. Well, that's nice. Jade got a nice buff this season. Fun build. We're going to try going in blind and just doing it without any attempt at figuring it out. If you haven't played Jade before, good the hell luck to you. Oh, great. I was about awesome. to ask, like, what button to click, but never mind. So, <laughs> uh, okay, number two. You want to cast that on enemies. You want to build up stacks. Jade is about building up stacks of your number two, uh, which has a radius burst around enemies. It's on a cooldown. Uh, your left and right click, these are things that you apply to enemies to deal more damage to them. But it's your stacks of your number two, your soul harvest, are what's going to actually be doing damage. You want to keep that at your five stacks at all times. And whenever it's off uh, cooldown, get around a group of enemies and uh, pop it. Your uh, number oh. four, I guess you just... Yeah, I guess your pets would just keep them out. All right, so we got it's a group here. Pop. Okay. Yeah, before you pop your soul harvest, though, your number two preferentially, click left and right on enemies. That's going to spread a bunch of... Uh, they're dots that do very little damage, but if you hit an enemy that is under the effects of both of those, you do like five times the damage or four times the damage to them. So we're doing the challenge riff right now. Uh, we are threading the needle. We found one. There we go. Another pack here. Another pack. Beautiful. Okay, we pulled ahead a bit. See Angel. Where's that D2 mask from? D2 mask. Okay, I'm on the next level. In the meantime, I don't know if you guys have found any Same. I'm elites. Down. I got an elite here. Yep. I had to pop my soul harvest because it just... It's going to fall off cooldown. Otherwise... Is this not how some Jade works? I'm not doing no damage. Hmm. There it goes down. We're good. Ah, oh, yeah, Muffin. Keep running into those Pop. uh, visions. Popping channeling. Nice. Oh, that's going to help next. so much. Yeah, go to next. <laughs> Blue bugger. <laughs> Tough question. Who has a tougher... Who has a tougher Riker? Wait. Who has a tougher Riker or Chuck Norris in his prime? I know it's right. Who is to well, I mean any question with Chuck Norris, the answer is Chuck Norris. The question hurts my brain. <laughs> I, I think there's a word missing somewhere. Or uh, I, I think the spirit of the question was who is who was tougher in their prime, me or Chuck Norris? Oh, and, and clearly I can take 
Chuck Norris in a competition of who goes down faster in a fight. This is a dead end right here, isn't it? Yeah. Got another pack here, though. Chuck Norris gave birth to his mother. Like, Chuck Norris gave birth to his own mother? <laughs> Wait, what? That got dark and weird real quick. <laughs> Real me this, I got a StarCraft pet, but I have no clue how I got it. Oh, so there was the StarCraft, you got the Battle Cruiser, right? That's my guess. During the StarCraft um, remastered thing, if you had logged into Diablo during that time, it was like a one month thing, you got the pet. I think, if I remember correctly, this was years ago. It's also for the collector's edition of StarCraft, one of them. Oh, okay. Well, there were the probes, I, I think, might have been for that. Oh, the probe, yeah. If he's talking the battle cruiser, which is the pet for this guy. Yeah, 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 exactly. Or was that, or that was, was the battle cruiser from the? Um... I want to say that was a collector's edition. One. Ah, okay. All right, we're good. We never have to do this again. That went pretty yeah, smoothly. For our first. Yeah, four twenty, perfect. Blazed it. Do you have any legacy gear from seasons one through ten? I do. I do. Yeah. Um, we're not going to show that right now because we're trying to speed uh, level here. So I'm going to keep it. I'm going to start us off on normal difficulty because our objective right now is to just go to the Darkening of Tristram event, rush, bum rush level five and click on that thing to get the gems. We're looking for enough diamonds, two diamonds to upgrade to a better diamond to then do our Good evening, Rye, Karen, Chad. Um, currently alter. snowed in at the casino. Looking forward to True Dungeon on Sunday. Hey, cheers, secret. I think we can actually make it. I think our friend's birthday plans have not actually panned out. So I think we might be free. Barring any last minute chain decision on his part. Hope you're doing well, secret. Uh, okay, so. We are in party together. Uh, I will go and grab... Follower's weapon? Yeah. Me and me and Curious are already running our way through Tristram. Roger that. Running? You don't run in Diablo one. <laughs> oh, tr trust me, the power like the grandma power walk is strong right now. You know what I'm saying? We're on our way. Oh man. Remember it feels also... so nice to instantly port to you and not be ported to the beginning of the dungeon and have to run to you. Gosh, playing D3 after playing D4, man. <laughs> ah, the retro filter, I love it. Speaking of Chuck Norris, we got some lashing tail kicks here. I got some roundhouse. Boom. Look at the polygons, all five of them. <laughs> Actually, now that I think of it, I don't know that I have any legacy gear from seasons one through ten. I have legacy gear pre loot 2.0, which I think was before seasons altogether. Yeah, that was. Like, I still, on one of my characters, I still have magic fine gear. Nice. It's all the monkey business. What kind of game does magic find? I mean, weird. It's just weird. <laughs> Alright, level two over here. Watch out for El Butcherino. We'll come back and kill him properly. Right now, we're just zooming to get the, the gems, but we're, we're going to come back and uh, run through Darkening to level up after. Right now, in fact, killing stuff and leveling up actually just works against us because it's going to make the monsters more more challenging. Schust! How you doing, Schust? Hope the family's doing well. Alright, level... Is that level three? In no, the dark passage. dark passage. Oh, okay. Never mind. Guess we gotta go to level three to get to level five. Yep, yeah, kicking back. Gee, I wonder what's in that room. You can TP to your teammates in dungeons in D4, use their portal at towns, but it doesn't TP you to them exactly, right? In D3, you get 
placed exactly where your teammate is. Not like at the start of the dungeon or at a checkpoint. So for those wondering what the heck's going on, yes, this is Diablo 3. However, this is the Darkening of Tristram event, which runs throughout January, which applies a retro filter to make it look like Diablo 1. And it's this series of... It, it's a 15-level dungeon meant to recreate... It's like a Diablo 1-themed dungeon within Diablo 3. It's the best way to describe it. For anyone used to Diablo 4, this is actually what Diablo 3 looked like the entire time we played it. This is no different. This is exactly what we played with. It was amazing. Uh, get, I'm down to King Lorik's tomb. Wait, is that the only way to go? No, because we want to go to a level... Uh, we gotta go 5, that's right. Yeah. Damn it. I keep finding the side, side right? content, man. <laughs> this is the second dungeon I found side. Yep, curious, is that it? Greg looking like Kerrigan here. <laughs> Especially with the retro filter. It, it looked like classic StarCraft 1 Kerrigan. I know you're supposed to look like Andariel, but I don't know. It looks like Kerrigan to me. No, I guess it right. looks like Andariel, actually. It's both. No, nah, no. Nah, too much clothes on to be uh, Andariel right now. Oh, it does TP exactly to them in the dungeon. Oh, okay. It's in the open world that oh. won't TP you straight to them. Okay. Oh, yeah. D4 teleports. Yeah. Anything special from this event? Well, the thing that we're going for right now is level 5 because there's a place where you can get a whole lot of gems. And we're going to need those gems to upgrade our Altar of Rights. And we want to do that in order to remove level requirements from items so we can craft ourselves a bunch of level 70 gear and lull their calls, co coaster through the game. Keep pressing M to bring up my map. This isn't D4. Hey, there we go. I just got a Harlequin quest. You did you? Yeah. Not you get the Shaco, of course. I got some godly plate. I found level five here. So I'm actually not sure what I'm looking for. It's some something to click on, right? I'm on my way. Yeah, I'm on the way too. Slowly. I think it's some kind of clickable on the ground. Oh, console version of D3 does not get the retro UI? Dang. Missing out. I'm trying to find it. Unsettled stone. Nope, not that. Unsettled stone. Nope. How do you get filters? If you mean this filter here, it's just... Found the magic rock. Aha. Ah, I'm we're good. I got two diamonds. I got more than two diamonds. I'm almost there. Yeah, I want to kill Fowling real quick. Yeah, let's, let's clear up some stuff here. Okay, so teleport out. Yeah, once you got the gems, TP out. We're going to need some uh, reusable parts. But I think we can get that from opening the Challenge Rift Cache at this point. Yeah. Alright, Challenge Rift Cache. Pop a lot. Alright, over to here. So... 
that, and then we're gonna get... Oh, well, we're gonna have to, right? Get the gem up to flawless. I mean, I'm here. I might as well just do this one first. All right. Flawless, diamond, or gray tour. I have a regular diamond. The little one's for fifth birthday. My gosh. I can't believe that. She's... Wow. Wait, is it literally today? Today's apparently my streamer anniversary. <laughs> Happy birthday to the little one, Schust. To Mini Schust. Alright, so we're gonna... Level him up. We're gonna get the diamond. Craft. Uh, but yeah, if, if by filters, you mean like that retro filter. It's You go to the darkening of Tristram event in the old ruins. And it's in there. Alright, boom. Wait, what happened? Oh, I didn't actually... I could have sworn I did it. What did I do wrong? I misclick? Oh, maybe I didn't wait the whole way, because I'm accustomed to D4 instant craft. Uh, Jolouis, yeah, we did the challenge rift, so... The Jade Harvester build is all about popping Soul Harvest. So, your left click and right click, you apply that to enemies. It is a debuff. An enemy under the effect of both of those is going to take a bunch more damage when you pop your Soul Harvest. It's all about maintaining Soul Harvest stacks. Alright, so, with that, we should now be able to craft ourselves level 70 gear and uh, kick complete ass. All right, so I need a dagger, if I remember right, if I'm rolling. I don't know if the strategy is to roll anymore. I mean, because if you gamble anything, it's going to be at your level now, right? Uh, oh, oh, yeah, yeah, okay, but for what to upgrade? Yeah, I mean, you might as well do a dagger. Yeah, 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 yeah no, you're right, you're right. Yeah, because you could yeah. you could just equip it. Instead of extracting it, you just equip it, exactly. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, so for upgrading for Monk, I'm going to go with the Daybow. Oof. All right, well, good luck we gotta to go. We got to go get it, though. Oh, yeah, we got to get the cube, right. Well, we might as well start cool. by just, you know, actually crafting our level 70 gear. We'll be able to crush through everything. So, forge weapon. Yeah, I already crafted a body piece, which is going to be able to hold. That'll be more than enough for everything for a while. Oh, yeah. Oh, screw it. I'll do a bunch of Sage's gear for more DBs to start. So it's, it's only a 19,000% damage upgrade. I don't know if it's worth taking. I'm losing out on the Archangel Staff of the Apocalypse. Uh, Alright, so now some armor. Let's get... I already played D3 and 4. I was asking which... Uh, other ARPG. Oh, uh, good story and decent combat. Oof. Um, Grim Dawn. I guess. I mean, last epoch is coming up. Like, I. You might want to sit and wait on last epoch. Where are we heading next? Or we want to we want to leave and upgrade to T6, yeah. right? Yeah, here I'll uh okay. leaving. We we'll make T6 and we want to start heading for the cube exactly. Red Zombie Panda Gaming four month resub. We're we doing well. Some people are like already level seventy. Now, I think I think thirty minutes is the record. Yeah, I think we did it one time in forty five. 
during this event. Oh, nice. It was pretty damn. It was pretty damn quick. Start season died twice, got demotivated, and stopped at level three. Was already tired from work. No. Oh, you're trying to evade that muscle memory. Hard to fight. How many people are hitting the space bar? <laughs> oh gosh. It does nothing. Nothing. <laughs> Let's get some gloves. And all right, boots fine. Okay. Are you guys zooming? Kinda. Ain't got vault yet, so. Hmm. Yeah. So avoid the enmities. Well, so technically, I think the fastest leveling will be through the enmities, but we'll uh, we'll start by doing Tristram at least one full run through. We can always save the enmities for like just general farming once we're level seventy. We'll see how it goes. Yeah, to get to the event, it's in Act One in the old ruins. So you'll find a waypoint in there. We'll show you in a bit here. Literally today, that is... That is something. Oh, legendary. Did I get the first legendary drop? Or Greg, how many have you gotten? Oh, oh my god. I haven't gotten any yet. Look at me, I'm the Greg now. I just got a second legendary drop. What the hell? Is this what it feels like to be Greg? This is amazing. Stole my thunder. <laughs> you know, Greg's Season only got 30. one thing. <laughs> and, you, and you're taking it from him. Like, what is he supposed to be now? Like, who is yeah, he supposed to be? That's my shtick. <laughs> Necro's still good this season? Absolutely, yes. I shouldn't be picking up anything. It's like no point. Alright, south, east. Elder Sanctum. Psychosis patient. Good to see some work of older games. Ah, yeah. 38 months. Hope you're doing well, Psychosis. The gods favor me. My I'm doing speedrunning tactics. Use up all your discipline as fast as you can, then level up. Hey, right, there we go. Um. I got a legendary now. Ha! Huh. <laughs> and an essence of something. Oh. I'm not essence even paying attention anguish. to that stuff. Let's essence go. of something. Wait a minute. What is even that? One of the shards. How are you getting soul shards? What? Ah, uh, just an essence of anguish just dropped. I didn't think that's possible. They only drop from bosses. That is like I'm beyond here. good luck. That is breaking ah. the game luck. Unless I'm they here. they changed how they drop. I thought they dropped from bosses. What? Huh. As a new seasonal character, do you need to play the campaign again? So, I don't know if you need to have done it one time ever, or they might have even changed the game that you don't even need to have done it one time ever anymore. But if you've done the campaign, you definitely never have to do it again. Alright, have a go on shoes to all the best of the family. Alright, cube time. We should have made a right Greg emote. Yeah, yeah, with the legendary beam. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well. I'm going to upgrade my staff. And, oh no. I don't have enough veiled crystals. How did that happen? Oh, because... Same. Uh, that's we fine. We're still okay. Alright, what's the next thing to hit up, you said? Uh, let's go Tristram. More Tristry. More Tristry. More Tristry. Oh, wrong port. The Durkening. We're already level 33, look at that. Alright, so those wondering where it was. So from this portal, you come over here. What is it, in the Dark Cellar? Or no, no, it's the portal at the oh, center of town, right here. There we yeah, go. Yeah, literally at the... Uh, and uh, then from here. Old Well. There you go. Find Griswold's corpse. 
Got all the corpses here, and you go over to the cathedral. Go, gonna go with Grim Dawn? Nice. How goes the D3 lore? I put out two lore videos in December, man. For anyone who missed the lore videos, I put out two in December. Yeah, he, he literally did more in a two-week period <laughs> than he's done in three years for the lore. Which is probably why you guys didn't realize it, because you thought it was spam. <laughs> Old time D3 player, played beta D4 but nothing more, just wondering if D3 is still the game to play or should I buy D4? Also, happy partner anniversary. Thank you for the happy anniversary. Uh, I, I mean, D3 is still a fun game to play, but it is now end of life. Like, it's gonna keep getting seasons, but you're not gonna get anything new in D3. Probably ever again. D4 is the game that they are continuing to update on a regular basis. So if it doesn't bother you to keep playing the same thing over and over with no real, you know, new content, then, you know, D3 is still going to be fun. I've played D3 for 11 years now. Uh, this might be the last time I play D3. It's weird to say that. It's probably not going to be the last, like, very last time, but... And it's nothing against the game, I just, I've played it for 11 years, you know? Even playing MMOs at eventual time, you stop playing. It's like at some point, you know, I, I moved on from D2. Not because I thought it became a bad game, but just, you know, want to move on to other things. Yeah. Uh, what is... Oh, the Dark Passage. Yeah, let's let's do the side dungeons now. Dark Passage, sure. Oh, we got Butcher right here, too, if you oh, want. Okay, let's go do Butcher first, sure. Let's do what first? Is he dead already? <laughs> oh, good old butcher. The implementation of the oh, oh he gotcha, he gotcha. <laughs> I wasn't ready for that. <laughs> the D four butcher, like that's one thing D four did really well. The way they implemented the butcher was really successful. So much better than D3's Butcher. Like, this Butcher is so much better than D3's Butcher already. Monkey Hood, 48 months. Oh, resub. All right, we get the remnants from this guy. I forgot about that completely. We could get soul shards already. <laughs> right, and there's a bunch of bosses, I think, in here that we can get soul shards from, isn't there? It's the Butcher's yeah. Cleaver. We need to get sockets, though. Oh, man. Oh, man. I got one. Let's see here. I got one in my helm. Which one do I want? I'll do increased damage. Good. All right, going back for the uh, side dungeon there. You have to save the challenge bag for the altar this season. If you're going to play... At least 15 to 20 hours before Monday Challenge Rift Reset rolls around, then save it. If you're not intending to play 15 to 20 hours before that point, there's no point in saving it. Do some stream lore since it's stream anniversary. Uh, I'm I'm open to it. I don't know what to do. Maybe having some of our, our vets here can help with that. I guess well, one thing we're alluding to is... Um, so, so Greg here uh, is someone we've been doing stream start nights with for a long time, and he is always the luckiest guy with legendary drops. <laughs> yeah, I think I started, what, around season three joining in and that, and it's, other than the rare occasions of being on vacation or something like that, been a part of all the starts. My gosh, it's been 30. Wow. I don't know why in, oh, my, sure. in my head, I, I guess I hadn't started from the very first seasons, but I guess... Yeah, I think I, I read first I season started August 29th of 2014. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Gotta get all these veiled crystals now so I can upgrade my dang thing. Uh, before Riker uh, abandoned it, 
uh, the chair was actually the star of the stream. This is true. This is true. Um, if you guys are not aware, he would go AFK, and all we would have to entertain us was the chair. Mm -hmm. That's however, the real reason not... I got rid of the chair. However, I was jealous. Oh, I knew it was a hit job. I remember. <laughs> you told me about the plan, and I'm like, that's a little dark. I'm not going to lie. The chair is currently sitting at the bottom of the St. Lawrence with uh, cement on its wheels. I mean, you showed it. Don't get me wrong. <laughs> had a GoPro to it and everything. I will not do that. However, it's not the actual first instance of the chair. The real question is, does anybody in the vets know what the real first edition of the chair meme was from? That is a good uh, question. Off the top of my head, I can't recall. I'm assuming you still remember. As soon as you say it, I'll be like, yep, that. Uh, I, I know terrible was a thing. I maybe have an idea, but I don't think I know exactly. So I think this well, is gonna be information for me too. <laughs> have you have you talked to her lately? No. Okay, yeah. so I, yeah, I know it's related, but I don't know exactly. All oh, right, her chair broke or something, right? She had a busted ass like piece of like just a wooden chair that was just like out of the seventies or something. <laughs> yeah, that's right. I I remember there being a wooden chair, just a piece of shit chair. Oh yeah, we made a we made like a a legendary item oh. of it. Uh huh. Oh yeah. Oh my already for my gosh. So just just this week or, the, or this week, yeah, I was like reminiscing about high school stuff with some of my high school friends and like thinking back on like how many things I've forgotten. And like that was like what I don't know, 20, 20 years was that twenty years? Yeah, it was like twenty twenty five years ago. And now I can't remember yeah. things from like ten years ago. Ah. <laughs> uh. It's crazy that I've been streaming long enough that I've forgotten stuff from when I started streaming. <laughs> oh my gosh. Alright, I know we can't do a poll for it. But... Okay, I'm gonna... Uh, hold on. Are, do you want me to drop the difficulty, or do we want to tough it out here in this darkening I'm, of Tristram? I'm enjoying dying a lot. Feels like D4, right? <laughs> no, I don't even die this much in D4. What are you talking about? <laughs> it is not ready yet. I I just need more veiled crystals so I can get my hopefully holy point on. I, I never got my Shaco in D4, no. Uh, yeah, so I, I as of 2018, I no longer have, well, ever since I moved into this condo, I don't have a, a chair in my office at all. I have a standing desk. Okay. Oh yeah, I could have converted mats, but I don't think I have, do I have an excess of other mats? I've been picking up uh, yellows. I'm not, I haven't even been equipping them because they're Trash by contrast. I'm building up slowly. It's alright, adds a bit more challenge here. What do you think about the concept of adding in other mounts other than the horse and Diablo riding a demon would be dope? Oh yeah, I'm I'm a hundred percent for adding in like more mounts, like saber tooth tiger when we get the jungle and whatever, yeah. I'm sure they'll do it, right? It's like it's it's just free money for them. I want to ride on the back of the butcher. I want to. I want to ride on the back of the druid in my party. When are they going to enable that? Oh, that would be. That would not shock me if they implement that. <laughs> yeah, come on. I think uh, what D uh, uh, World of Warcraft already has that. They really? can implement that. Wow, has that for real? Yeah, that like uh, the druids when they shape shift into a certain form, uh, other players can mount them. That's in the party. amazing. Oh wow. What year was I born? I'll let you folks guess first, and if you guess it right, I'll let you know. Old man Riker. Old man Riker. I must wait. Which I forget if I'm slightly older or slightly younger than you, I can't remember. 
It's one or the other. I remember that. Yeah. I think slightly uh, jump, younger. Jump yeah, down to the so. tomb. I'm going to go back and repair for a sec. Oh, oh yeah. Leave us with King Leoric, huh? Yeah, 100%. Yeah, I'll be back. Don't worry. I'll be back. In fairness, we can start the fight and you'll come back and we'll still be in the middle of the fight. Probably. I didn't even set up my passives yet. Oh, passives, right. Oh, changing skills, right. Oh. <laughs> okay, dang, that you guys got that fast. I expected a bunch of wrong dates before Sundification here comes out with exactly the right number. Holy crap. Like, what the heck? I mean, you've been kind of vocal about well, maybe yeah. on Twitch stream, but this is someone from YouTube chat guessing it. Are you saying they can't watch you on both? Eh, it's possible. It's, uh, ow! Whoa! Alright. Yeah, maybe maybe I'll look at my... my items. I mean, my uh, skills, rather. Or lack thereof. What has happened with yeah, the graphics? Every... This is the Darkening of Tristram event. It's like a retro filter that they apply. It's really cool. I was about to start hitting space on my items to flag them for destruction. That is not what game we're playing here. What are y'all talking about? This is like peak. I mean, we're running 4080s here. This is like, you don't get better than this. <laughs> uh, okay, let's see. Uh, you're gonna die. <laughs> you're gonna watch it happen, dude. <laughs> it's goading them I on. Could, there's nothing I can do to stop it. <laughs> I came in late, you pulled them back, and now I've been pulling them back further because I don't want to die either. <laughs> I must wait to use that ability. They're dead. Okay, I, I'm gonna I'm going Whack. back to town momentarily here to <laughs> rejigger my skills. I I didn't expect to be level 55 already. Okay. So. I gotta go back too, because it's getting spicy. I could. <laughs> uh, alright. Get some movement speed. That feels good. Get some spirit gen. Oh, yeah, more spirit. Yeah. Even more move. Let's do it. Some sweeping wind. Oh, he died. Oh, nice. Yeah, I leveled in town. <laughs> Salvage so a bunch of stuff. I'll go back down and start progressing forward. Roger. Okay, 21. Alright. Uh...
with some thunderclap. Quicksilver, sure. Down level four now. Welcome to the Thunderdome. <laughs> All right, I think I'm going to drop us to at least Torment. Four. Yeah. All right, immediately better. I took a shot and didn't get one shot, so yeah, that's better. Yeah, so the Jade Harvester build for the Challenge Rift is a very specific kind of build. You gotta pay attention to what the set actually does. Uh, don't just like spam buttons and hope for the best. It's Soul Harvest is a critical mechanic. You need to be setting... It's, it's a build where you need to set up your dominoes before you can knock them down. Gotcha, Lee Titan. Cheers, man. Do we want to be killing uniques down here? Oh, yeah. I mean, they dropped the, um, the soul shards, right? Did I the Skeleton so, King drop the Soul Shards? Yes. It, they dropped something, yeah. Yeah, so when we run into them, we might as well want to yeah, kill them. Because I'm like, we passed up a named mob. Yeah. Oh, let's go back on, for it. On the on the last floor? Yeah, Garbad. Oh, yeah, how, how right, far back is it? Not literally right at the entrance. Okay, let's do it. Entrance exit. I was like, aren't we supposed to be killing these things? Uh, yeah, yeah, we can look. We can look into that. We'll see. It depends on what else is going on at the time. Where's Garbad? Did we kill him? Uh, yeah. Oh. Yeah, he got killed. Oh, okay, okay. I thought, uh... Somebody has green stones already, because he blew up. Ooh. Well, I mean, I, Iggy, I'm pretty sure, already knew exactly when it was. Armored and saying, watching and listening on YouTube, chatting on Twitch, aka no ads. Ah. That's the 40, the 400 IQ move right there. The door's stuck? Nah, you had to put the orb. Gotta put the thing in the thing. My strength fails. I must wait to use that ability. Uh, you remembered completely correctly, Iggy, yes. Already 60, that's insane. <laughs> Like, we're doing such a scuffed suboptimal strategy, and we're already 60. Like, it's just... Oh, man. Arcane's Valor. Oh, no! Cable! Oh, rip. Rip. I think that's in the halls of the blind, isn't it? Oh, uh, yeah. Go to the halls of the blind. Not Falls of the Blind, uh, what was Isn't it? it? 
No. Oh. Halls of the Blind has all the invisible. Ah, oh, right, right. This is the something of bone, isn't it? Chamber of Bones? A passage of Bone or something. Bonerland. Bonocalypse. Bonocalypse. I think I named my necromancer one time Bone City. Oh, yeah, okay. I dig, I dig. Did we just break D3? So, I, I believe the fastest level is 30 minutes from season start. Uh, we are... We're going for fast-ish, but not, like... We're not using optimum tactics here, because we're... We want to enjoy the targeting of Trisham event a bit. So that we're not good. <laughs> well... Oh, are we on level five? Yeah, more gems, nice. Yeah. More jams. And now that we're 61, they were all good level stuff. So. Yeah, I know, right? Ah, yeah. Going down. We're just cruising, yeah. So again, we are in the Darkening of Tristram event, which applies a retro filter that makes the game look like Diablo 1. Huh. Slain by chest. What? <laughs> yep. Um, look, I'm I'm special, okay? I'm just saying. There's a there's also an invisible mob here that you guys keep going past that keeps killing me. Sure there is. Oh, there he is yeah. I must wait to use that ability. I throw weak. Yeah, Greg finally killed him. Haha. Although I am a paper right now, I don't know why. Well, we are level 62. And I am a demon hunter. I must wait longer. It cannot be done. It's funny, we're gonna hit level 70 before we even finish the darkening of Tristram. That's hilarious. <laughs> Ouch. It is not ready yet. Uh, you did not. Uh, yeah, we got Andariel on our team. Yeah. We've allied with Andariel. She's helping Ooh. us out here. Where is she? She's right there. Yeah. yeah finally has, has seen the way. There used to be a bug in middle of D3 that caused breakable doors to kill you if you attack them from the wrong angle. That's hilarious. Wow. That was wild. That was not my issue. <laughs> <laughs> My issue was I was killing, getting killed by very invisible POs. The Chamber of Bone. It's the Bone Zone. Rip. Yeah, 100%. I gotta go back to town. I ah, yeah, is broken. I must wait to use that ability. This fight is over. Is not ready yet. I must wait to use my that ability. Grow 64. I think we can hit 70 before an hour's up. Thanks. 
Let's go apply this dot on a bunch of enemies and run away. Things are going to slow down considerably now, though. That's the only thing. Should you drop it to T2 and we finish out that way? We are on T2. Oh, I thought I thought we were still T4. Oh, Chamber Bone, right? There's like basically nothing in here. That's Sag. There we go. Nice. I don't know. I beg to differ. There was a kill streak. Yeah, there was a fair amount of people that killed me in here, so. <laughs> How you doing, Age? <laughs> oh man, so I had a YouTube comment on a like a two-year-old video, my my Diablo 2 Ultimate Guide, and the comment was basically asking, "How do I know?" Hold on, what was the exact? Let me let me let me pull up the exact thing here. How do you find out where to go in Diablo 2? In other words, how do you track the quests and find out where to go? Uh. And, uh, it's... It's like a real testament to, like, old, you know, style games versus new style games, right? Like, like back Listen in the day, me. you know, not to get all... <laughs> old man yells well, like Cloud. Well, if this is not a redundantly named item... Enigma Enigma! <laughs> Of course, Greg's the first one to find Enigma, or to build Enigma. Dear, dear Diablo 3, your naming convention is... Okay. Wow, my first my first legendary is a Heart of Iron with a Witch Doctor uh, impl implicit on it. Very okay. smart loot. Nice. Makes sense. Yeah. Ow! Nope. Smirt. Stupid getting smirt dogs. Dude. Yeah, them poison balls, man. I need wheat to use that ability. It is yeah, who needs to be alive? It's fine. Protection shine over here. What you ask is important. Clicky. The gods favor me. I'm click I'm clicking it. Alright. <laughs> I could use twenty five percent less damage. Back in the day you had to call Nintendo to know what to do in a game. There you go. Oh, here's the halls of the blind. Dude, the uh, Nintendo so Hotline was the biggest ripoff ever. Oh yeah. <laughs> Earliest recollection I remember of that is that. Wait, you had to pay I... for it? Yeah. Oh yeah, it's an eight hundred number. Oh shoot. Wow. Yeah, I think the recollection earliest of that was my brother had to call that line for Zelda two on the NES to like see how to beat like Shadow Link. <laughs> For, oh, the wow. first thing I would have to say is the pain of Zelda 2 on the NES. Hey, that that game was great. I I know it's a dark horse of the whole franchise apparently, but I love that one. Dark would be the nicest way of putting it. <laughs> Abomination against gaming kind, I think, is a, another term it's, for it. It's not even the worst Zelda game. What are you talking about? Which is the worst? It cannot be Probably Twilight Princess. I don't know. I did. I didn't like Wind Waker just because of the uh, graphics. I know it's a great game, but I just never played it because I could not get past the cartoony graphics. That's fair. I was about to. I was about to say I wouldn't say Wind Waker. There's a bunch of people to be mad at you. Oh, I know. No, trust me. Like I said, I I know it's a great game. I just it's it wasn't for me with the graphics. Uh, this, yeah, the CDI Zelda game. What's that? Oh, man. I believe... I'm sorry, I, uh, I'm thinking, uh, Skyward Sword, I think, is a bad one. It's the bad one. What's the CDI one? Oh. 
<laughs> well, excuse me. <laughs> Have you do you do you remember when like they were first introducing games on CDs where they were like, we can put full motion videos in now. Oh. Uh, you ever you ever wondered where some of those extremely terrible uh, Zelda cartoon memes come from? Uh, okay, so the Excuse Me Princess, that's from... Okay. Uh-huh. <laughs> but those were great. For meme potential. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they were great 20 years later. <laughs> for hey, meme they, potential. they served their purpose. They knew what they were leading up to in time. <laughs> I like... I like the person in chat that just says, like, chat, is this a mod? No. <laughs> no, this is D3 graphics at its finest. <laughs> Apparently, New Hyrule Warriors was terrible. Saying, uh, Justin? Uh, the, it's basically Dynasty Warriors, but Zelda-based, yeah. Mm. So if you're not that style of gamer, not for you. Oh, I love me some Dynasty Warriors. For the people coming in late to the chat, though, yes, this is a special event in D3 that happens only in January, I think, yeah. actually? Yeah. The Diablo 1 anniversary event. What you ask is impossible. Which eventually they're going to have to port over to 4. Right? Like, especially with the dungeon setups in D4, I think it could be really cool. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Getting, like, a massive multi-level dungeon... No loading screens. Would be nice. I must wait longer. I cannot do that. And during the event, it is the best way to level. Period. Uh, I, I think uh, using the Visions of Entity would be better. You still think so? Yeah. There's not enough, like, density in here. It's still worth doing, like, to get, uh, you know, grabbing those gems level 5 was clutch. Um, I think it's worth doing to farm your soul shards. But... I think Visions of Enmity. Well, technically, I think, you know, the fastest way is going to be running that super dense dungeon, right? Uh, what is it? Temple of the Firstborn? Yep, got a leap back here. Yep. Baron Sludge. What you ask is impossible. Godly Plate of the Whale. Yay! Huh. Like my 17th King's Sword of Haste. <laughs> oh, I've, yeah, I've... I will admit the thing that they did do that is also both good and bad is the fact that you can't auto salvage the gear from here. Right. Mm. It's like. Like, it's good for the first time you go through because you're like, oh, I wanted to save that. Yeah. Oh, the and then the next time you go through it. <laughs> yeah, you're like, God damn it. Why did you get in my inventory? It is just a simple little thing with some gems on it. <laughs> it's not a jester's cap. <laughs> See? All right. If they really wanted to get meta with this, what they should have done was allowed you to dupe items. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's a deep cut. By the way, yes, I'm trying to get a job at Blizzard. It's great. No. <laughs> <laughs> Gracias, uh, LOL Drew. That ability is not yet recharged. Dude, did you just phase through the wall? Oh, yeah. It's my favorite activity. Uh... Yeah, you like having to do flips to move places. I will not do that. Just, just some derpy meme of like a demon hunter flipping into the wall continuously, carbot, <laughs> carbot style. Uh, 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 uh. I can see that. Ah, broken storm. And he's dead. 
It is extremely broken. <laughs> and I'm full pack, so I'm dropping and yeah, going I back. I need to run back town real fast. Yeah. Salvage some of these yellows. Try to get some of those crystals. Oh yeah, I'm gonna do on crystals. Nah. Nowhere close. D4 Season 3 will allow you to play in D1 Remake of D2 that is played in a D3 Remake that is remade in D4. <laughs> oh, man. I look forward to, like, revisiting some of the more f other familiar places in, like, D2 and D3 inside of D4. Can't wait for when we eventually can go to, like, Tristram, Old Tristram in D4. Round mushroom. Uh, I think that's all we were in here for, anyway. It's funny because after a while, like you stop noticing the filter. I will not do that. It's like, that's just the game, right? Got, well, let me make my legendary. After a while, you don't even notice it. You just, you know, stop seeing the code. Then you go back to. Going. Oh, nice matrix Town, reference. You're like, my eyes! <laughs> it's so bright! <laughs> 4K means 4,000 pixels. <laughs> Happy anniversary. Why does it look like that? Uh, unfortunately, my video card died, so I'm running off of, like, motherboard graphics right now. So I'm running the game at, like, 480p. <laughs> I like how you didn't even say, like, a weak card. You're, like, motherboard. <laughs> Straight to the board graphics. Integrated In graphics. <laughs> Intel 2700 for the win. I think at level 10 and 14, I think I still need two rare spawns that spawn in these. Which, that was one of them. Oh, Come you're on. trying to catch them all? Yeah, I mean, I figure might as well. Yeah. I think the next one, the uh, last one I need is Steel Skull in 14. Because I did need that one. I just noticed, I was like, oh, wait, we just killed him. Cool. Yeah. Yeah, for the, for the achievement, I already got all that stuff. Let's just hope Season 3 doesn't do a Diablo Mortal crossover with three times on microtransactions. Yeah, I don't think there's gonna be a DI crossover, and I mean microtransaction wise, like the only thing they're gonna do is add more like shop stuff, right? Looking like Ultima Online 2.0. Oh man, Blue Horn instant death. Look at that. Who did that? Is that Curious? Curious has got his, you know. Oh, you got your Carlays or Lord Greenstones or something. Probably point, yeah. I just got me my uh, green stones. Oh, nice. I just got me my nothing. Yeah, point. Yeah, green stones plus point. King Sword of Haste. King Sword of Haste. King Sword of Haste. How many kings were there? Three, last I remember. I came from the Orient. Or rather wise. Why the last time? Because this is the last... This is probably the last time D3 is going to get a substantial update. This feels like we are now entering full-on maintenance mode. We got a huge balance pass that... Uh, I don't think we're going to get another balance patch after this. I think this is going to be the final meta state. We're going to repeat past seasons going forward. We already have a repeat this season. Last season was the last new season. Can I run this on my 970 GTX D3? Absolutely, yes. I ran it on a 970 for uh, a while. Ooh. 
D3 can run on a potato. D4, not so much. But even D4 doesn't have super steep requirements. Legendary amulet. Oh, well, nice. well, well. Yay. I have not gotten legendaries ever since I got, like, my two at the start. That's Those are my legendaries yeah. for the whole stream. I'm done. Yeah, you're done. Well, I was saying, I feel like I remember this game looking better. <laughs> it's crazy what our memories do, man, you know? Yeah. Uh, nostalgia glasses. Yeah, nostalgia sure. glasses. <laughs> It's like playing the original Final Fantasy VII, you're like, I don't remember there only being seven polygons this entire game. <laughs> Duncan saying this looks so much better than D4. Jeez. Ouch. <laughs> oh, man. But can it run Crisis? <laughs> yeah. Is D3 better than D4? Uh, and I think it's not unfair to say that in some ways, like when it comes to just pure arcadey fun, I don't think any RPG beats D3. Like if all you want is a game to just like chill to, kill monsters, feel powerful, progress fast, like D3 is the tops there. No, what have I done? <laughs> Cheers, Duncan. <laughs> Town. Town? Which moon? That moon. These last two levels are uh, taking a little longer here, but we're uh, we're getting close to to Bizzle, level thirteen. I really wanted to say that's no moon. <laughs> that's no moon. I must wait to use that ability on the wrath of Yitar. In our uh our home D D game, one of the player characters was named Moon. And at some point, uh the party all died, went to the Shadowfell, negotiated for their Negotiated with the Raven Queen for their return to the mortal realm. But when Moon was sent back, there was uh, a hitch. And instead of Moon getting sent black, uh, back, a, uh, a, a effectively a shadow clone of her did. A sort of like dark mirror of the original Moon. And I think we just recently had the reveal that it's not actually Moon. And so we could finally... After years of sitting on it, have the that's no moon memes. I need to go back. Look, all I'm saying is comedy and timing are not just done improv all the time. You know what I mean? Like <laughs> some things take years and years. The setup. Set yeah. <laughs> like I know I got one sitting on it. Wait, just wait. There you go. What do we got here? And when it happens, it'll blow their minds. <laughs> uh, I've actually got, I've actually got the Christopher Nolan like boom noise, oh, like ready to go right, for it. There we go. <laughs> All right, we're good there. Um, and legendary this. Nope. Dude. Oh, nice. You got a Lego from that? Damn you. And I got that achievement. Last two unneeded. Nice. One last time for real, asking Leon. Uh, so already I didn't think I was going to play Season 30 at all. Um, the timing of it just kind of worked out well. Where like The season was actually kind of interesting uh, with the balance changes. And like it's a dead time right before D4. But like if this had you know launched a week after the start of like D4 season, I don't think I would have played. Um, so... This might be the last time. Like, I also, like, I wasn't even sure I was going to do a tier list video uh, this season. So, um, I, I, you know, only a Sith deals in absolutes, so I don't want to say I will definitely never play again. I'm not, I don't want to come out and make some grand announcement of, you know, this is, I think D3 is over or whatever, but, like, um. You mean, like, other people? 
Uh, yeah, I mean, I mean, that's fine, right? It's just, you know, but, um, oh, I also, like, I don't want to commit to not, like, playing again. I, mean, I guess that's the other thing. Yeah. Like, I don't think I will, uh, but, I mean, is it possible? It's possible, but if things go the way I expect them to, where, like, next season nothing changes at all, I don't know that I'm going to be back next season. I don't think there will even be a need to make a tier list video next season. Um... Plus, by that point, Last Epoch's gonna be out. Like, Last Epoch releasing, you know, mid to late February, so... It's gonna be another game worked into the rotation. Why does D3 on my PC look... Uh, on PC look different? Um... I have a really bad video card. Don't make fun of me. It's all I, I mean, to be fair, the amount of time you've gotten out of your 970 is impressive. <laughs> Oh, shoot. Meow got me. He said, only a Sith deals in absolutes is an absolute. Thus, I am a Sith. You know what? That's actually a really... That's that the is... first time I've seen that pointed out, and that's really astute. Meow, that makes that... The make... Star Wars is even dumber now. Curious. It's just the Jedi that are dumb. Okay, that's fair. Yeah. <laughs> Who uh, was it? Uh, Obi Wan that said that? Ewan McGregor. Uh, uh yes. Yeah. Well, not Ewan McGregor, but like. It wasn't. Yeah. It wasn't. I mean, it, it was in the prequel trilogy. It wasn't in the original trilogy. Like they never even mentioned Sits. I don't think in the original trilogy. Oh yeah, they did. They did. Uh okay. I would say it's a Jedi mantra, but I think the most famous line of remembrance is when Ewan McGregor said it, yes. Do or do not, there is no try is also an absolute. This is true, but it's a different person saying that. It was Yoda saying that. So they can just say, like, Obi-Wan's an idiot, and that's not actually... <laughs> it's not actually true. Uh, you're saying a doc you're saying a dogmatic religious style zealot thing is hypocritical no <laughs> oh man I just saw that oh shoot okay I'm in the Lazarus room here I just caught up on this like meme from a year ago uh, which is the oh, gotta... if it was made in 2007 meme so Transformers 2007 the first like Michael Bay Transformers oh soul shards Ended with Optimus Prime giving this awesome speech while a Linkin Park song is playing. And mm -hmm. I don't care how cheesy it was. I, it, it's, it's amazing. It was awesome. And the music was so fitting with it. And I don't care. It was amazing. Uh, so <laughs> it became a meme about a year ago to take whatever like movie or thing... In, if, it, if it were released in 2007, and, like, they just play that music. They, they, they basically remake that. Um, gosh, can I... If I do this, I'm going to get, like, DMCA'd. God, I wish I can show you guys. Go, go, search this on YouTube, all right? Do, Ooh. um... Kenobi 2007. I think Kenobi 2007 should get you there. I'm going to Google this myself to be sure. Kenobi 2007. Yes, top result. Go watch that. I'm, I'll wait you do, here. You do know by you saying that I now have that Linkin Park song playing in my head, right? Well, you have to share with class and sing. I know. Ex <laughs> I'd, have to pull up the I'd have to pull up the lyrics to do it right. And also, I am no, uh, I am no Chad. You're no Chad? I don't know what song you're talking about. Chad. Oh, Chad. Which Linkin Park song is it? Um, the, the name of the song is... Uh, yeah. What is it, dude? Hold on a second. Uh, it is it is what I've done. What I've done, yeah. What I've done. That's the one. Yeah, oh, I know it very well. Like I, as soon I can, I, I can, I can play it on the piano. Oh, nice. Uh, 
Or at least just the just the like just the like the opening like dun, dun, dun. it's it's a very simplistic thing Mike uh, put together for just a riff on it. It's super easy to play. I can do the start of um, God. What is it? Hmm. Dun 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 dun. Starts with one thing. I don't know why. What's the name of that? What's the name of that one? But in the end. Yeah, in the end. It doesn't even. Yeah, it doesn't. Yeah, it doesn't matter. I can do that one on piano. I can't do what I've done. Um, I've done. Um, I used to be able to do the opening to the Cheers theme. Hmm. Like that. Wow. And then the and the actual chord itself too. That's great. But the problem is, I would do the first chord. And then it's kind of like, it's kind of like literally when you say like, in another language, I don't know how to speak your language. And then they look at you and say, but you sound oh. like you do. And you're like, yeah, no, <laughs> I didn't learn to play piano. I just learned to play this one thing on piano. Yeah. Yeah. I, yeah. I learned how to do these like two things and that's it. Sounds okay. like me on my bass. The the most I ever yeah. learned was crazy trains opening the doo 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 doo. Oh, bass. Yeah. Nice. Bass, that. That I have a lot more into. Uh, I will 100, like, if we're going to go nostalgia, I'll admit it. I was in a ska band back when I was in high school, man. Oh, look at that. Yeah, I mainly, I bought we had the black, black, yeah, yellow shades, black horn rim, you know, glasses, you know. Nice. Like I had to commit. Uh, learned how to play Real Big Fish. A lot of Real Big Fish. Uh, Green Day. Oh, yeah. Some, some, no doubt. That ability is not yet recharged. Main reason I bought a bass back in the day was just because listening to uh, Red Hot Chili Peppers. Oh, how perfect was that? I ding seventy right on Killing Diablo at the end Same. of the Tristram event. Amazing. Nice. Could not have poetic planned that better. Wow. I wish I could be as cool <laughs> as you. Uh. <laughs> Uh, yeah. Look at those two people who are still 68. <laughs> hey! hey. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, yeah, okay, so so if you guys already watched the, 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 the Kenobi clip, now do Oppenheimer 2007. And that one is legit, like... So I, I thought Oppenheimer was a phenomenal film. Uh, it, it totally would not, like, be fitting to, to have Lincoln Park playing at the end of it, but... It actually fits so well and better than any other application of the meme. Because the lyrics. Oppenheimer, right? Famously quoted the the, the, the Hindu scripture. Uh, you know, I, I am become death, destroyer of worlds. Where it's all about the guilt of realizing what have I done. Right? And in that moment, you know, the, the song kicks in, what I've done. And it's like... If Michael Bay made Oppenheimer, well, <laughs> yeah. If uh, instead of Christopher Nolan, it was Michael Bay making Oppenheimer. I am returning to town. Ah, uh, all right. So, uh, with the Durkening of Tristram done, Let's go do some Visions of Enmity, maybe, to get a bunch of mats and stuff. What do you guys think? Or we can actually... Oh, no, what we should be doing is a season journey to get our sets. Yes. Uh, one sec. I'm resetting so that I'm... not complete... terribleness. Just 90%. Oh, what is the first pinned comment? Yeah. <laughs> I am Obi-Wan Kenobi, and I send this message to any surviving Jedi taking refuge among the stars. We are here. We are waiting. Oh, gosh. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh, gosh. Yeah. <laughs> Now I'm saying, I mean, the Jedi thinks there are no more Sith, so the balance is tipped to one side of the Force, and they're still looking for someone to bring balance, as in tipping it back to the dark side. <laughs> the whole religion's a sham, man. It's a big sham. Oh, god. I mean, to be fair. <laughs> oh, boy. Ah, oh, red soul shard. No, I want the sliver. 
The Siver Sliver. This this zone is too 3D for me. I can't do it anymore. <laughs> it needs more pixel. More pixel. What I need is sockets. I need whatever is chasing me to stay away from me. Because <laughs> it wanna kill me. How dare they. Next floor. Yeah, so the reason those graphics are pixelated, it is the darkening of Tristram event. Act 1, go to the old ruins, go to the middle of old Tristram, go through the old pixelated portal, play through the event. It's a nice little throwback event. It's really it's a cute little thing. Nice to experience at least once. Lopez, 71 month, a oh, resub, hope you're doing well. It's a it's a Diablo 1 themed dungeon within Diablo 3 is what it is. Hey, huh? Curious, finally got one. Yeah, and it's a witch doctor. Oh my <laughs> gosh. What? Yep. Time to reroll. Super smart. <laughs> yeah, it'll oh, only take us like 10 goodness. minutes to get you at 70. Wow. Wow. Ooh, legendary ring. It cannot be done. Uh, it's like a puzzle ring, actually. Oh, nice. Ooh, That's helpful candy. for everyone. Yay! Ah, I'm fire. helping. Besides just looking good. Fair. What you ask is impossible. I'm not running around. I'm waiting for this to be put down. Damn you. Oh, I keep hitting space. <laughs> Some habits die hard, you know? Like Sith are greater than the Jedi. I mean, if the Sith weren't so, like, you know, killing each other kind of thing and not being able to trust each other, I mean, they absolutely would have won that war, right? If you ever want to trigger an online platform of nerds, explain that Michael Bay, in his truest definition of the word, is an auteur. <laughs> that argument's so valid, I have to look at what, what it means. <laughs> I can't compete with that. <laughs> Internet argument logic? It's yeah, open. that challenge rift was on the harder side for sure. My understanding grows. I still don't even know if I was helping at all in it. I was <laughs> existing. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, do this. I'm like, do what? <laughs> oh, I gotta kill Shiro's. I'm not going LOD, but you know what? I gotta go wave a light now. First player to complete speed, dammit. Do I prefer oh, D3 or D4? Uh, so the game that I would rather play in general right now is D4. There's still stuff about D3 that I prefer. But I've played D3 for 11 years. Uh, it's not that I don't like the game anymore. But just I think it's normal at some point to feel ready to move on from something. I was about to say, like marriage. But... Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> With the things I've been through in life, trust me, I'm allowed to say that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The storm breaks. Actually, there's a, there's a fun one. Yeah, you want a statistic. Uh -huh. I've been I've I've been around you 
and around your stream so long. I wasn't married when I first started Wait, watching, really? and oh. now I'm still, and now I'm not. <laughs> I thought you had already been, oh, okay. Huh. Nope. Oh, but you were no, together, I, though. Yeah, I think at that point we were. Okay. Yeah. So. Oh, uh, Archie on me. It's still a funny statistic, though. <laughs> I guess that's a word for it, you know. Yeah, I'm struggling, and then Curious just comes over and one shots. <laughs> uh, right. Yeah, that wasn't me. Oh, yeah. so who came over and one shot it then? That was me. Ah, all yeah. right. Oh, yeah. You have Demon Hunter showing off. I know, right? That green stones. small. I had a green stone that is me. I just don't have the holy point to go along with it. Zoe's secret. Ooh, convention elements. Imagine if that one had listened. We would have angels and demons for servants. We'd be riding them like horses. <laughs> You're not even gonna stop this shit. Sure no, 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 disgusts no. me. This belongs to the trash. Spite. This thing sickens me. <laughs> oh no, it was a creds flame. Damn. Oof. Not nearly as good. Kadali yet because I'm not oh. the 70. I got Nems. Nice. There is that. Uh, okay, so next on the journey. Five bounties. Ah, oh, come on, man. Gross. Yeah, yeah throw that's it. I'm done with this season. I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well. I guess we can split bounty farm. So, yeah, let's just do act one, I think. I'm doing well, Crazy Train. How are you? I need to hang out with somebody who's going to be killing a lot of mobs. So I still need my 70. <laughs> Are you not I able to kill stuff on your own? Uh, not well. Really? Okay. No, I'm not geared properly at all. All right, all right, all right. I got a goblin on me. I don't know what it is yet. Sounds like a regular one. If and anybody wants that. I got my fan of knives on right now. That's about it. I got a basic uh, loot goblin on me if anybody wants that. I'll pass. Mm -hmm. I got to enter a crypt. Okay. 
What do you mean five bounties? Everyone back to the pile. Ah, we're doing this dungeon now, but in uh, non-retro mode. Feels weird, man. Whoa, what's this story, Andrew Johnson? Goblin. What kind of a goblin? Mr. Creep. Ah, uh, yeah, dead. dead. Yeah, that's fine. That's okay. Wait, I should get air ally going here. Did that really happen, um, Andrew Johnson? Do you think Diablo 4 has the systems in place to be as replayable as D3? Itemization needs to be uh, addressed, and it is being addressed in Season 4. Um, they are continuing to add content on a regular basis. I don't remember if we need to do Skeleton King, so I'm going to come for this. Uh, if we're still at Torment 2, I think it'll count. Ah. Well, we're on hard, yeah. Well, we're on hard, yeah. I just saw that as a bounty. I'm like, eh. Wow, Andrew. Jeez, okay. Hey, legendary. Nice. Well, not really. It's one of the essences. <laughs> Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Let's start putting in a soul shard. Just go on cooldown. Hold on. So this goes on the helms. This goes on the helms. How do we upgrade these again? Hmm. I will be right back. Uh, so appar uh, apparently, a uh, muffin, um, Coach Red Pill was, um, Uh, his life was taken. I'm I'm only vaguely aware of him. I saw him like debate destiny. That's the only reason I know about him. But yeah, someone took his life. Hey, cheers, Wesman. Have a good one, man. Uh, no, you know what? It's not worth swapping yet. Not worth swapping. Oh, okay, so it's not known what happened? There's a speculation then, okay. I think if I should, uh, well, if I drop us down to normal, I mean, I'm imagining Curious and Greg are already, like, just super overkilling things right now, right? As long as my fan of knives is up, it, yeah, one shot yeah. everything. 
Fan of Knives is like auto kill, but like yeah. beyond that, it's hurry up and wait. What you ask is impossible. And I'm only a bar and a half, two bars from 70, so. Well, prepare to face my wrath. Our meddling daughter will do well to leave us be. Father Wrath. Face my wrath? Oh my god. Did he literally say that? And his name is Wrath, R-A-T-H-E. <laughs> Hello, mother. Hello, father. <laughs> I am calling from Camp Granada. See, Fanta Dives is up. Did you pop this resplendent? I was like, there's a resplendent chest right here. Is that all things? Oh, looks like all things. I need to go back. Uh, oh, okay. No, we're not done here. <laughs> but the bounty was done. I'm about to leave. Now it is. Now we are. All right. It feels like the visions of enmity don't spawn as often as they did last season, which is reasonable. We got, we got one when we were going towards the cube. Yeah, and I think also like right away, but we haven't since then, right? Not that I've seen. Uh, we haven't seen anything pop up. Oh, I'm wondering. It's because we didn't do it. Do we have to like remake the game to get another one to spawn? Hmm. Yeah, I'm not from. I'm not remembering the mechanics of it all. Let's see. Uh, okay. Socket five gems into your gear is a surprisingly challenging one. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't expect it to be. And yet, here we are. I think I just need to do one more for that. Kill Queen Rania, kill Sedea. You can just unsock it and sock it in again. That works? Oh, okay, that's yep. hilarious. <laughs> I'm heading for Queen Arania. I'm gonna try to at least. Ha! A vicious strike. Ah, uh, okay, it's because you can only have one vision of enmity open at a time because we spawned it. Yeah, another one's not gonna spawn. Um okay. So yeah, we would have to remake the game. Thank you, uh Fell. Hey dude caught up. There we go. It cannot be done. This is not the way. What you ask is impossible. Do you know the way? I don't it. Mm, donut. You guys have any luck? Is it your direction, my direction? Uh, not yet. You can have multiple visions in a game, just not at the same time. Have to complete one for more to spawn. Exactly, yeah. So because we just, like, we let it spawn and we didn't run it in order to get... Like, we, we can't find wherever it was uh, too far away. I'll do it. We would have to just remake the game to get them to spawn again. Okay, I think it's going to be up this way. Yeah, this looks right. Arania. 
Want to hear a cover of the song Titanium? But instead of I am Titanium, I'm Queen Arania. I think it's supposed to be Arania? I forget the actual pronunciation now. That shit's <laughs> instant death. Oh my gosh. Alright, Sedea now. Act 3. Glad I could be here for this moment. You were there for support. I couldn't get in there with my fan in ice fast enough. <laughs> I got an itchy trigger finger, so. The blamo. <laughs> oh yeah, do we have a command uh, on? Because I, I remember at some point we did. Yeah, okay. Uh, Arania. It is Arania then. Yeah. Uh. Oh, uh, wait, Aran- no, it might be Arania. Arania. Arania? Oh my gosh. <laughs> this fight is over. Uh, Rania. I, I think it's Arania. Just go find uh, one of the textbooks in the world, and I'm sure there's something that'll say her name. Ah, <laughs> Queen Uranium. Obviously. How you doing, Nathan? Out of all the events in D3, what was uh, your favorite? Mine will always be the Dark Name Tristram. I don't know if it's plausible, but I'll be event in D4. Yeah, the Dark Name Tristram is such a good event. Um, I, I, it wouldn't surprise me if one day they add something like that into D4. Feels like they they have the technology. It it feels like with the D four Lord where they're located, it's probably going to be more applicable that they do something with Diablo two and a callback. Hmm. Fair. Yeah. Ooh, Not to say they can't, but just it seems like they're already kind of setting that you know domino up, so to speak. Yeah. I think they're going to... So, I believe that eventually in an expansion we're going to unlock the Western Continent and be able to visit Tristram. And I think we have to wait for that before they would, you know, do a retro event. How would you compare the fun factor of D3 with D2 or D4? I think D3 has... The most like concentrated like fun per minute kind of game now you might burn out on it faster than these other games but like for just like the most arcadey fun turn your brain off kill monsters d3 is the most fun yeah i think it was from brandy nim i feel like i remember being brandy I got an ember so I can level up one of my shards. Oh, okay. It's because I haven't got any ember. That's how you... So how did you get an ember? Is it just a, a lucky drop? Uh, Dropped off uh, the rare spawn before the... Uh, uh, Could we salvage these to get embers? <laughs> um, I think so. If you salvage those items... What did it say it was? Give me one second. Uh, you either get three Imperial Gems or one Flawless ru uh, Royal Gem. Oh. So if you got extras and you want some decent jams. <laughs> that actually worked. Oh my gosh. All right. Uh, Nephilim Rift on Expert, a higher difficulty. Fully equipped a follower. Magda, hard, hard. Uh, okay, so we'll remake on um, Expert. Did we not get a bag for... You gotta complete Chapter 2 to get your first bag. Two. That's what I thought. I was like, I'm like, I think we get it off that board. Yeah, it's every uh, other chapter, I think. Hey, thanks, uh, Voodoo Man. Right, so you get three bags, so there's four chapters, so... You just don't get on the first one. You get yeah, two, you three, just don't four. want two, three, four. Oh, okay. 
Easy. A new recruit has joined my party. Teach all the recipes. Nephilim Rift, okay. Nephilim. Probably shouldn't have salvaged all my stuff, because I don't know how do I put my follower. Just throw all your gear on him. Could I do that with... I guess I'll do it with the Templar. Still gotta get him some stuff. We just buy some like garbage items from one of these dudes here to give him. Yeah, get him one of these. Ooh, set item. Come on, Blackthorns. Oh. Uh, hand crossbow. Nope. <laughs> That's easy. Donatas. Which actually, at this point, I'll take. Is he going to also want a shield to count? Yeah, I gotta get him a shield. Okay. We'll get him some Rinky Ding shield. Soul shards seem to drop like crazy from the visions of enmity. Ah, alrighty. Yeah, the visions are so good at just getting, like, everything to drop. So when we want to actually farm things, I guess once we get our six-piece rocking. We're about halfway done with the rift. Ooh, I got a consumer wall. Nice. Event, not Ramalama Ding Dong. Oh, okay. Ramalama Ding Lingies. Yeah. I got an Ember. Your strength fails. Thanks for the anniversary wishes. I mean, spirit is impossible. So what it that's that's a good question for all the legacy peeps that have been around. What does everybody think the most attended as in concurrent viewer stream was for Riker? Do I know the answer to that? Yep, I hear I hear a I'm pretty positive you know the answer to that. Oh, gem goblin if yep. the mods know the answer to that, so they're not allowed to answer. <laughs> Hmm. We had an emergency meeting about it. <laughs> it was that one? Wow. Oh, yeah, it was. Absolutely. Even more so than the one the next year? Uh-huh. Wow, that's sad. <laughs> oh, God. What do you think brings out the people? Uh, that's fair. Jeez, man. That's depressing. Oh, my God. <laughs> Yeah, Morgana's uh, got it. Wow. Mm-hmm. I don't know off the top of my head. I will not do that. <laughs> it was redacted. <laughs> I need spirit. 
And I remember it fondly because while at Blizzard, fondly, I tried to fondly, yes. Okay. Because I could say I could I could say that because I do. Uh, my phone died in the middle of it, so I couldn't. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Oh, set boots. You got set boots. Yeah. Dang. And blackthorns. Did you really? Yeah. Nice. How cruel is it that they allowed D three to come to an end and they never, they never fixed blackthorns? I know. Right? Have read the blackthorn set. Come on now. <laughs> well All right. Do you wanna? You wanna? Spell out the answer for those wondering. So, yeah, like I said, uh, Morgolis got it right. It was during the infamous uh, announcement around Diablo Mortal, BlizzCon 20, I believe that was 18, if I remember yep. correctly, right? Yeah, yep. it was. The one yeah. BlizzCon I was at. Yeah, uh, yeah the BlizzCon... The BlizzCon I went to where they wouldn't let me into the main hall, but me and another mod, Kiskalu, were there, and they pulled us aside, and they had us sign an NDA and said, do you want to do something special? And we said, yes. <laughs> and we got to play. We were part of the live demonstration of Diablo Immortal being played. Only for then everyone to be like, boo! <laughs> <laughs> and I Oof. believe I'm quoting that properly. Uh, but... <laughs> Yeah, boo, uh, boo seemed like an accurate quote. Uh, was, yeah. Was a little too polite sounding. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, it was, uh, I believe, if I remember correctly, you hit upwards of... God, it was... I don't think you hit 100k concurrent. I want to say it was like 25, 25k or something like that, concurrent viewers. Yeah, that sounds about right. It, it was it was way more than normal, and it was it was incredible. And it was also <laughs> higher than my because because the year after I streamed D four, so I, I didn't uh -huh. even hit those numbers then. Dang, no, what a shame! No. What a shame! Uh I think I I do think it's funny though that the public perception of Immortal I would say has changed not completely but it is way better than it was at the start like the initial outrage like there's a lot of people yes it's better in that people just don't care as much anymore <laughs> yeah exactly it it went from fevered outrage to eh. Oh, oh, Nemesis is uh, pulling out an actually. Wait, the 20... Wait, wait, wait. 21957 was not... That that must have been D4 reveal stream. Then. Was it was it the was it the D4 stream? I thought that one only hit 15 to 20. Place 3. Place 3. Okay. I'm wondering if if place 2 was this BlizzCon. And place one, what? Rank one was from 2021. Wait. 2021? What even happened in 2021? What? Is that the stream where you had T-Pain on? <laughs> no. <laughs> Rank two was D4 beta in March last year. Huh. But hold on. Wait, what wait, wait. Curious, what was your guess? Uh, resurrected. Yeah, Houdini, it was definitely the hot tub stream. Makuna7, thank you for the raid. D2 I mean, resurrected I... is when I hit my peak viewership. Wow. D2R? You must have been raided by a couple people. Oh, that makes sense. Okay. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. I must have missed the raid on that one for the peak, for peak viewership. 
Okay, Adria, Adria. I'm guessing Curious is already almost there. Yeah, in. D4 beta was only 12,000. Immortal was ah, just under. Wow. Mm. What about this BlizzCon? What do we hit? Uh, was it 8K? Actually, what about the... What about the BlizzCon 2019 when I streamed D4? It was the first time anyone saw D4 being played. I know my YouTube video got like a million views. Yeah, the YouTube video was good. But the stream didn't get... Oh, you know, okay, you know what's gonna, you know what's killing the numbers that I didn't think about? No. Uh, some of those were not done on your channel. Huh. Some of them you were doing for Blizzard. At uh, Blizzard's. That would not show up on your uh, statistics. Okay. This fight is over. Got it. Because I think the D4 one was not on yours. Possible. Could be wrong. I know that I was able to upload the videos directly to my YouTube channel after. Oh, well, that's the case that it had to be on yours because they weren't gonna they weren't gonna let you offload. Hmm. I do remember there were a couple times though where you were uh, streaming on the official. Yeah, through through their account. Okay. I just don't remember which ones are which. Hmm. This fight is over. It cannot be done. Did we reach her? Wait, what the hell is this? Oh no! Uh, this is something I've else. Never seen this event. Ah, come on. This event? Oh yeah, sure yeah. Oh, we can just run away uh -huh. from it. I thought we were locked in there. <laughs> they saw no, things on the door. I'm like. I don't have Interesting. No, there's a special room with a chest in it that you get if you kill everybody. Yeah. Oh, god damn. Where's stupid... This fight is over. Last BlizzCon... Oh, okay. No, oh, it was right here. My strength has increased. Ah, Atria. There we go. Do you remember your first Twitch follower and sub? Was it you, Muffin? Uh, okay, so now, in fairness... Uh, well, okay. So, follower... I, I was streaming for years Dungeons & Dragons before Diablo stuff. So, it, I remember some of... Like, I remember the names of some of my first, like... Um, you know, back when we were, like, just a couple dozen viewers to D&D stuff. Like, we had, like, a little, a little small recurring audience um first sub though i mean it's gonna be like <sighs> i mean i know I like kiskalu is among the old guard i argo as well i think i don't think kisk was the very first yeah, Kisk and Argo are, uh, Argo are marked as first because they were in the first. I think the first you you get the first tag if you're in the first. Was it twenty? I think. 20, yeah, like 20, 25. Greg, were you on the? F no, you no, I don't. I don't have first tag. Right, I mean, right. I'm at ninety five months right now, so I'm like right there with everybody with the longest. I think it's just a blur for me. Gosh. It's crazy. Eight eight years. Eight years of being partner, meaning I was probably streaming for what, nine years then? Like You were streaming Diablo. before partner, yeah. Yeah. And then like I'm not really counting like the D D, you know, as part of I guess the regular streams. All right, so now we should all have our two-piece. Uh, let's see, I think I just need to do one more. 
transmog. Laura. Yes. Why do you keep glancing over? Yeah, and I'm coming. And I'm coming up on eight years pretty quick here. And other than them, I was like one of the last mods added where they were all like, "Who's this guy?" I think I next. Uh... Yeah, next update for me will be 96 months, so eight years. Yeah, so you might have been right right before me. Yeah. Yeah, how you doing? Lucid on the beat. Lucid Bail. on the beat, I like it. Yeah, but Keisha's got a point. Potentially Bale? Oh yeah, Bale, yeah. Bale's a maybe. Jhow up there? Or, um, uh, I I, I know that there's a way that I can look at this. These stats. I just don't know where to find it off oh. the top of my head. Oh, Titan no, Red ne Baron's up there, isn't he? No, Nemesis. I didn't come. To, I didn't come to fame for my math support. I came for the preservation of Riker's liver. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> math was just a part of that. I was I was doing him the service of realizing that being a one man show is not always the best way to go. When you're trying to keep track of everything, including rolling, oh you know, gosh, all the donations, dice, yeah. everything. Uh, okay, we got a remake on at least master. I'm gonna see. It might be T4 actually. Um. Gosh, we gotta do all the acts. Okay. Uh, yeah, we'll do it on master. Oh, you're in three. I gotta, I gotta still finish out two. What are you missing? Uh, follower and uh, jewel. Easy. Follower and jewelry. Oh yeah, people were out for blood. I mean, especially uh, yeah, Morgulus, especially like when when Wyatt came on. Um. I felt so bad for Wyatt. Like people were like really, really being harsh on Wyatt. Really that spiked, and that actually, we still actually get unbanned requests today from the people that are like, "We, I don't even know why I'm banned from this channel." And then we look back at their comment, and we're like, "No, we do." Well, you threatened to stab Wyatt in the head, you know? Maybe. Yeah, it's like it's like you basically gave verbal death threats towards an individual you know nothing about. So yeah, you can. I mean, you can learn from your mistakes, but. You can still also be held accountable for your mistake. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. You know, s somehow, like, a lot of people manage to get through their lives without threatening to kill people. You know, it's difficult, yeah. but some people manage it. I'm not one of them. But, you know. <laughs> <it's>... <laughs> <laughs> I've played Overwatch, of course not. Uh -uh. <laughs> it's impossible. <laughs> But it's usually meant because that's part of the game. You know, taking out of context, you know, there's nothing I can do. Uh, the D&D streams were, uh, were, were pen and paper. I mean, a, as in, technically we played over a virtual tabletop, but it it was not D&D Online. It was a tabletop game, yeah. Not enough spirit. Uh, increase the base passive effect of your Mystic Ally and the base passive effect of your Mantra. Right. Her sub was right, correct? I mean, I guess technically. <laughs> uh, you kind of always are your first one if you look at the stats, yeah. That is true. Uh, Riker, what weapon do you need for your build? Uh, everything. Well, what, what is the specific right, do you, question? Uh, do you need an ingom for any reason? Oh, um, let me see. I could make use of an ingom, sure. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I can step in gum. Oh. oh yeah, God. you got a uh, NEMS, right? I do. I'm on my way. What you ask is impossible. Uh, clicking it. My yes. We zooming. We zooming. Generation Z right here. Yeah, you guys go. I'm still in town. Muffin followed less than a year before I got partner, because back then you needed certain stats on Twitch to get partner. Yeah, and I was one of the ones who found you. The info that you can use, uh, your YouTube uh, viewer numbers. All right, yeah. I need spirit. 
All right, so I mean, I you know I wasn't streaming D three for super long before making partner like max a year. Well, hold on. So if it's eight years, eight years ago takes us to two thousand fifteen. Yeah, I started streaming D three for the release of Reaper of Souls, which was like March twenty fourteen, roughly. So yeah, about a year. I think the interesting statistic would be when you started streaming what was your twit or what was your youtube uh subscriber count at when i started streaming or when i got partner uh when you started streaming well when you started streaming diablo content i guess is the best way to put it. I, I so when i started making diablo content on both twitch and youtube i had like maybe two thousand subs from D, D stuff yeah. And okay. rapidly, within like a couple of months, got to like 30k, which is why I was like, okay, well, I guess I'm a Diablo channel now. <laughs> I guess I know what I'm doing. <laughs> Been doing this D&D &D stuff for years. And, you know, I was, I was happy with my 2,000 subs and my, you know, like 12 Twitch viewers in D&D. &D. But, um... You know, when all those numbers were coming in for Diablo, it was like clear that's what the people wanted, and uh, there was a big audience for it. And yeah. and here we are. And here we are, eight years later, yeah. I will not do that. Doing it for the last time. <laughs> I, I almost don't want to, like, commit to saying that just because I don't want to have to face the... Like, gosh, you know, there's like the that expression, or I don't know if that's an expression, but like at some point, there's a time where it's the last time you ever see a person, or the last time you ever go to a place, and you generally don't know that it is until like years later you realize, yeah, I, I never saw that person again after that, or I never went to that place again after that, or like in this case, yeah, I never played D three again after. That day on January 12th, 2024. Well, I mean, after you TPK our group tomorrow, then that actually it will have a good reference point. You know, whatever. <laughs> um, but, uh... <laughs> uh... I, th I think more people are critical of that now, after the pandemic, because those moments happen more in their lifetime. Fair, yeah. Where that was a higher possibility than, you know... It's like being faced with a mortality of something. Yeah. Like yeah. a near-death experience where you're just like, wait a second, this could be the way it happens. Oh, shit. Mm. Ooh, legendary bow. Yeah, Muffin, that's a good one that a lot of people bring up. Yeah, like the, the, the last time your parents like ever picked you up in their arms kind of thing. It's a, a poignant one. For a lot of people, that's the last time anyone ever picked them up in their arms, for that matter. Am I full on blood shards? Hey, look at no, I'm not. Why is it acting? I kind of want to. I kind of want to say something. Be like, yeah, like my dad ever did in the first place. No. But, no. <laughs> uh, yeah, scroll wheel bound to force move. I do it in all games now. Deaf gamer, how you doing? Hello. I definitely learned that one from you. The force move. Ah. That one was definitely a learn. I learned it by watching you. <laughs> yeah, there's not enough DBs to do much. Well, he's got a bunch of veiled crystals now. Oh, I guess this I'm doing the bounty, huh? I'm doing the quicker picker upper. So technically, actually, can I craft? But the hmm hmm see there's so much variety it's the spice of life I guess I'll try gambling for boots but then what am I gonna upgrade Hmm. 
We go for the rings, but not a big priority, I don't think so. Uh, okay. Butcher, Urzael, and then all the ugh, all the bounties, man. Bounties. Ugh. ugh. Yeah. Do we have to? Black. I mean, the game says we do, yeah. Uh, so, game. Hate to break it to you. Yeah, of course I got Rivera dancers. LTK boots. Come on, man. <laughs> Don, how you doing, man? The last time I flung a slice of cheese on a baby's face. <laughs> so, that's this, there's this, like, trend going around. Apparently, if a baby is crying and you throw a slice of American cheese on its face, it stops crying. And there's tons of video evidence that this works. The baby is so perplexed that it stops crying. I was going to say, it makes sense to me. <laughs> I guess if someone threw a piece of cheese at my face, I would shut up immediately if I were talking. I or, I'd yeah. be bewildered. Like, what the fuck? Yeah, I believe, I, believe that, I believe that exact retort is the, he's out of line, but he's right. Like... <laughs> oh, man. Do I have my... Uh, ooh, Does it have to be American I'm, cheese? I'm, yeah, because otherwise it's not, it's not floppy enough. Uh, flat Got me enough. an enmity portal. Oh, uh, port to you. I'm wondering, like, do we want to do the enmity now, or do we want to keep... Because we we still got to do all those other things, right? Yeah, but it's here. Ah, uh, sure, okay. Where are we? Might as well do an enmity. <laughs> My argument, it's, it's right here, dude. Yeah. <laughs> we already skipped one. <laughs> 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 the argument. Come on. Like, all right. Yeah. Come on. I literally. Yeah. <laughs> I am not ashamed to say the come on. <laughs> Counterpoint. Come on. The cheese trick works on girlfriends also. Yeah, it works on a lot of things. Oh, man. Grumpy Stu saying, I'm going through that with my twins. They constantly come up to me and ask to be picked up. So I do because they are getting to the point when, where tomorrow they will not ask. Brings a tear to my eye, Grumpy Stu. Oh man. Yeah, that version of it is uh not nearly as much fun to think about. At least like you're at a stage in your life where you know to like cherish the moments. I think in our youth we're more naive and don't realize like the importance of Yeah. Really taking the time to savor the moments that we uh, don't realize won't be there anymore in the future. Does it have to be American cheese? Um, I say yes. I think so. Otherwise, it's not floppy enough. Like, it wouldn't throw right. Mm, the aerodynamics okay. are off. You know, like, it's... You don't want to use too sharp of a cheese. You don't want to hurt the yeah, baby. You cut him. Yeah. Uh -huh. Limburger cheese does not work. Okay, we got confirmation. Limburger cheese does not work. Just a little wheel of cheese at the grinder. I'd probably just make him vomit. Yeah, I was going to say, that'd make it worse just because now you're offending the smell as well as, you know... <laughs> And I got a Lego chess piece. Nice. Uh, yeah, I've I've exhausted all my legendary luck in those first five minutes. You really have. <laughs> the gods strike through me. Not enough spirit. Hey, speaking of two legendaries. <laughs> nice. I'm gonna stop saying the word. It seems to bring him power. <laughs> he feeds off of it. You're only making him stronger. Have a good night, underdog. Have a great weekend. I appreciate the sub, man. It's 
It's quite literally uh, Beetlejuice syndrome. Every third time you say <laughs> legendary, he gets one. <laughs> Gotta use nacho cheese? Oh god, I don't know. I don't know that I That's throw. a waste of good nacho cheese. Uh, it seems dangerous to the baby. I don't think the like like it's that's melted cheese, right? Yeah. The, it's either gonna be too hot and like scald the baby, or like it's gonna like block their nose and mouth, and they don't have the manual dexterity to free themselves. It's not that hot, typically. Lukewarm at best. Hmm. And spray cheese. <laughs> yeah, cheese. Yeah, there you go. I think it still has the same desired effect of what the. F <laughs> A wheel of cheddar to the head is a bit too weighty. Yeah, just a bit. Just oh God, that's a that's a salt. <laughs> eh, it's a little salty, but uh, it's not too say, bad. It's still a cheese, not a salt. Yeah. Let's say if we can hit him, hit him, hit him with a wheel of Reggiano Parmigiano. You know what I mean? <laughs> Bam! Oh, too weighty. Way. Ah, uh, clever. Oh, oh, I want no. it to be known. A vicious strike. Where is it? Here? I wish that we could have done on me. Instead of like doing the bounties, we can you know we would just uh get the bounty materials through the visions of enmity. I need to go back. Clicking, clicking, clicking. Ooh, in time. Or casing. I wouldn't even complain if someone threw expensive cheese at me. Yeah. Yeah. Mm, it's reasonable. It is reasonable. Rogar's huge stone. I mean, you know they had fun at the naming convention on these things, for sure. Oh, yeah. Do you need a convention of elements? Because there seems to be one on the floor. Yeah, I just got a second one, so if anyone needs that. Or uh, wants it just for temporary purposes. Is it in your rotation, it. Riker? I gotta get a focus and restraint. Oh, uh, okay. I guess I'll cube it. Because I'm gonna go U, I'm gonna go U E multi. Nice. Assuming I can get that tonight. <sighs> uh, Butcher Urziel, the bounties. Extract it. Make it sound like you're saying, like, not the bees at this point. Not the bounties. Mm, not the not bees. The bees. <laughs> ah. Mr. Smith's. I'm gonna go fill up on some water. I will be right back. it when I gamble. I don't get what I want. <laughs> Gambled for two bows trying to get God, what's its name? Uh, Recurve. Yanks uh, Recurve. Yangs, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Raven's Wing and uh, Leon's Bow of Hashir. Disappointment was had by all. Womp womp. Is Maxwell trolling with their start of T on T1 advice? No? How are you... 4K Chicken, what do you mean by trolling? The season's kind of weird, to be fair.
did no damage on a level up explosion. Huh. I know that works. I don't think we normally do it on T1. We do it on Master, though. Yeah, I'm familiar with the process, uh, Chicken. I've, I've seen it work, but we normally do it on Master, not on T1. So I can't, I can't speak for that one. I don't know off the top of my head. I'm just a disembodied voice. I'm no Riker. I'm at the butcher, but I'll wait for Riker to get back. Oh, you're at butcher? Cool. That's it. I mean, guides are... Guides are good, but they are just that. They're guidelines. Like, everything's subject to personal needs, interpretation, or what have you, because I don't know if you've ever played, like, Path of Exile, and you got to build... If you don't follow it to a T, like, you can have, like, 20% of the damage by just having one or two items off. It's ridiculous. Diablo 3's builds, since they're so... Like, since they're just sets most of the time... It's so specific, but it's so much easier to get stuff. But certain actions and quality of life stuff like that just depends. They might have done some testing. It might have worked on a one-off. Who knows? They normally don't try to steer you wrong, though. I know that. Like They're definitely trying to help. They're not trying to like make it worse for you. And we're back. Alrighty. What's going on, Luke Oates? You're being blackmailed by Steam. What's going on? Uh-oh. Time to kill the butcher, by the way. Yep, I'm gonna start the butcher fight. How's it going, Grumpy Stew? What's my favorite place to get a Putsin? Hmm. It's a great question, Lou. Um, I think it also depends on whether I'm going for like a fast food poutine or a uh, like a proper meal poutine. Um, most of the time that I have poutine, it's more like fast food things. So I'll start with like my best bottom tier poutine is McDonald's. If I just want something cheap and fast, of the various fast food poutines, I think McDonald's makes a very passable, acceptable poutine. Next, if I want like uh, a more like proper meal poutine where um, it's not like, you know, the fanciest, but like, you know, just like a decent poutine. Um, I think Jerry's Smoked Meat. Uh, they make a smoked meat poutine, which uh, I enjoy quite a bit because the, their smoked meat is good. And so that on top of the poutine, uh, very nice. Gravy is good. Cheese is good. 
then if I'm going you to, have, mm -hmm. you may have to clarify because someone has already asked in the chat, is it not said poutine? Uh, yeah. So the way we pronounce it here, where it was invented is Putin. Like, it's actually Putin. <laughs> Vladimir Putin. I was, say, I was about to say, I was like, did you push up your glasses and be like, actually, <laughs> actually, actually. So I got another thing of enmity if people want it, or do we just want to skip this one? I think I think we'll we'll unlock our our chapter four first. Like we get our six piece, and then I think we'll like spam the visions. Okay. Yeah, the re rewards weren't that great when we did it this time. Yeah. Right. So Come there's French the from France, and then there's French from Quebec, the French part of Canada. And while it's the same language, it's the difference between British English and American English. Some things are pronounced a little differently. There's different accents. And so in, in France, it is Poutine, but in Quebec, it's Poutine. How do you find the aerodynamic properties of the Poutine versus the newborn? <laughs> I would not throw a Poutine at a crying baby. No, it's, it's too messy. Sometimes the gravy could be quite hot, uh, and it's a, it's a in. yeah, it's a waste. It's yeah, like wasting one it's slice of American cheese, like whatever. That's also why you don't want to be using like a nice, you know, a Havarti or something. You know, it's a bit, it's a bit too wasteful. Uh, Quebec French isn't real. It can't hurt you. It's not yeah. real. It can't hurt you. <laughs> you know those moments where you take a bit too far, and you're just like <laughs> reflecting on it, being like. <laughs> we asked, can we? Maybe we should have asked, should we? <laughs> Gem of Imperial or higher quality? Well, will, um, diamonds. Urziel, and then all the freaking bounties on extracting it. I got nothing good to extract. Oh, so I could extract that. Before. Greg, are you running towards uh? Brazil. Brazil. Yeah, Urzil. yeah. Searching for it right now. Okay. It was as though I was trapped in a waking nightmare. I looked down and saw tendrils of energy wrapped around my feet, and realized it was not fear that held me, but the Seraph's magic. Hmm. I mean, I guess it's a straightforward, easy buff right now. So not Putang, Potang, or Putang. Not at all, no. Putang? It is Wu-Tang, like though. That is a completely different thing. <laughs> I remember the movie called Pootie Tang. <laughs> Pootie! I just realized... We turned in an Act 1 bounty cache. What did I get? It wasn't a Ring of Royal Grandeur, I'll tell you that. I got yeah, an Yeah, 4K. Disembodied voice here. You're welcome. <laughs> we were having... Uh, Max Roll suggested putting it on T1 and using the level up bonus to blast Zoltan Cool. Mm. Uh, I said, we've done that on Master before, but we've never done it on T1. I okay. could see if you had a party for T1, maybe, because then you'd have multiple sale. explosions. Oh, maybe that's it. If you're solo versus in a party, mm. in a party you get more expl uh, level up explosions. Therefore, more damage. My master has begun. Reasonable. Blah, 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 Arzale. Your master can... Yeah. Who's hitting the first fan of eyes? I'm going to just yes. sit here in the corner, think about what I've done. You should. We're all here because of you. <laughs> Literally. That's true. That's true. That was all. Hey, you want to play D3 one last time? One last hurrah. I mean, to be fair. To be fair. Um... I actually had to cancel plans with other people to be here, so... Oh, yes, geez. actually, I did. Yes. Oh, damn. Mostly because I've also told you in the past that I'd always be here for you on, on night. So you, you, oh. when I make a promise to somebody, I actually keep it, unlike the majority of everyone in the world. 
Um, so. But what if you had also made a promise to the people that you were going to be getting together with tonight? I didn't. That's uh, the point. But what if you had? I'm smarter than that. I know which one you could point. Now knowing that for the rest of time, my Fridays are now yeah, available like, because I no longer have to worry about D3 season starts. <laughs> okay. you've, been Look, I gotta, for, you've been free I gotta from those checklist. shackles, huh? I got a checklist, man. I stay true to my promises, no matter how detrimental they are to me, because I'm a man of my word. And it's hard to say that nowadays, <laughs> no matter how much it hurts. I have kept this promise for going on, what, five years now or some shit? I don't even know how long. Yeah, Either way. Yeah, it is so true. Ask when, me, when you say you'll do something or you promise something, I, you, you stand by it. It's very true. No matter how much it hurts. No matter how much it hurts. <laughs> All right, what do we got here? Uh, are we doing Hold split on. bounties right now? Yeah, just doing split bounties. Okay. Oh, we did the last boss? Yeah. All right. Jeez. Yeah, we're, okay. we're down to I don't even know that I'm able to do split bounties. I'm gonna try. <laughs> do they have to be on master difficulty? No, they don't. The bounties? No, we can rip them on norm. But are you guys able to easily do it on this difficulty? I mean, I'm having no issues right now killing stuff myself, but if I'm I'm fan of knivesy, so I'm fine. All right. Here I am with the monk. A bunch of demon hunters just easily destroying everything. Like, we should be on T6. Freaking Riker holding us no, back. No, I'm not. I am not saying <laughs> yeah, that. No, 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 no Nothing no, no. like that. <laughs> you put putting out uh, evil on it's Ricky Bobby. <laughs> I did not consent. I did not consent. <laughs> you know the Messerschmitts, but... See, I don't even know that I want to go with they upgrading one of those. <laughs> yeah, you know those monks. They start slow, but they finish strong. <laughs> <laughs> You're being blackmailed by Steam for $100 in gift cards. You are being scammed, Luke. Just ignore it. Don't worry about it. That is a sc that is 100% <laughs> scam. Well, you can either pay us on this or, you know, Steam gift cards are just as good. Yeah. Yeah. The the, you know, the worst is when it's the IRS I, calling you, asking you to pay back your taxes and gift cards. Which is weird yeah. for me, because I'm not even from America. So, you know, there's something fishy when the IRS is asking for money from me. Yeah. You owe us this amount. Or, I mean, Target gift cards are just good, so just go down there and get some. <laughs> to, be fa to be fair, it appreciates more in value than the U.S. dollar. So oh, like, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> oh, did I get Captain Crimson? I'm getting audited this year. Oh, I did. Nope. <laughs> uh, it's funny because it's probably true. Um, I got that. I got that. Oh, get rid of that. Just hold on to that. Um, I might as well put something in my head. Um, just gonna cool down. I think we can do a market destruction in the meantime here. Yeah. Bop that on. Alright, for old time's sake, I'm gonna check if it's there. Nope. What were you checking? Leorks, Leorks Mansion. Uh... For some weird burnt piece of crap. Rip. The burnt shin bone or something. Yeah. I don't care what anybody says. Still don't exist. Yeah. Moo 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 moo. Moo moo. Moo moo moo. Have you ever invaded an older title such as D2 and swarmed the servers with players? No. 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 I mean, we played D2R when it came out, but no, no. We, we, uh... 
I guess we've never tried to organize a big thing like that. If uh, that's the question. It would be cool. Uh, but I don't know that we can pull that many numbers. Yeah, we've never really done organized chaos before. Yeah. I guess we could. Well, I mean, in the case of D2, like, what would that, what would that look like? I mean, we can pull eight people, but, like, it's not like an MMO where... Like, how do you really influence a lot of people, you know? I mean, if we all knew how to do that, we would all be making money like Logan Paul. So. <laughs> Luke's saying, no, it's real. They took my account and locked it. Okay, so it's not Steam then. It's it's someone has stolen your account. Yeah. That you're not being that's blackmailed. Still a scam. Yeah. You're not being yeah. blackmailed by Steam. You're being blackmailed by people who stole your Steam account. In which case, why aren't they just using your Steam account to buy stuff? Because there's no money inside the account, probably. Uh, I would contact Steam support immediately. Uh, yeah. Can you not change your password on Steam? Did they do that? Did they? Did they? How are they even contacting you? If they're locked, if they're locked out, they've changed the password and said we're gonna we'll unlock it if you send us money. It's usually connected to a, like a similar email address. Okay. I'm not saying I do this on the side. I understand the the mechanics. Yeah, can't you just say I forgot my password and get... Or did they change what email is associated with your account? Depends on the level of what they've done. I will not do that. Oh, kill all enemies. Whoops. I, I should actually kill things then. It. Respect the side hustle. Oh my gosh. Uh, Austin Plammer. Yeah, if you're able to, immediately change your email, your password, change your Steam password, change everything. Um, contact Steam support. Tell them the situation and see what they can do for you. Maybe they they can see that there was unusual activity, like like they can see someone logging in from a different IP. They can change back. Maybe they can revert your account to the previous password, the previous email and stuff. Yeah. So. Whatever you do, don't, up. like, don't give in to the. What you ask is yeah, don't pay him. Or don't give anything. That's yeah. That's wrong. Because they might just, you know, not give it back to you anyway. No honor among thieves kind of thing. What do you mean can't? Why can't you? Just... Do, I, I would also say, do be aware, guys, that there is something going around on uh, Discord lately. Not our, uh, not in Riker specifically, but I know in general, general. that there's been a lot of... Uh, like, DM hits by people saying, like, I have something urgent to tell you, or you won this, or stuff like that. Uh, if it's from somebody you don't know, it's probably a scam, so be aware. I know you can't log in, but is there, like, you can't just contact Steam support? Like, there's no, like, here, can we just pull up, we go to Steam. Is there no Steam support? You can just send them an email? How can I contact Steam support? Help.steampower.com. Yeah, there's some type of mechanism. You, just have you to click help, I can't sign in. Um, my Steam account was stolen. I need help recovering it. Here, here's the link. Follow this link right here. There you go. Although, wait, does this even have... 
Yeah, recover my account once you're sure. Yeah, reset my password. Uh, change your email's password. That ability is not yet recharged. Your flaws are revealed. Muffin saying, I'm very certain that having Death Blood Nova on the bar isn't to use it as its attack speed is so slow compared to the one from Siphon Blood slash Iron Rose, and damage is also considerably lower. Hmm. Uh, okay, let me let me look a bit further into this muffin. Let me see. So the question is, why do we have it on the bar? We just have it on the bar for the rune because without it, Simulacrum uses the unrune skill. Ah, okay. It's because when your Simulacra are copying your your Death Nova, if you don't have it on your bar with the rune selected, it's not going to properly carry over the Funerary Picks Blood Nova. So yeah, good on you for uh, for asking the question and questioning things, Muffin. You have won a personal massager. Please send social security number, date of birth, and bank account number to claim your personal reward within the next 24 hours. I mean, to be fair for that, I would. <laughs> they cost a lot. Are you really doing this as your last season? Possibly. So I, I thought I wasn't even going to play season 30 at all, um, but then I got tempted to do it. So it's possible I'll get tempted again for season 31, but... A big part of it this time was the timing was just right. Like, I was done with D4 for the season. And... We're like a week, you know, two weeks before the start of the next D4 season. I was interested to see how everything's going to come together now with the, the Visions of Enmity and the Altar and the season theme. Take my blood type also. <laughs> Give me a name, number, serial number, how tall you are, whether you're susceptible to any diseases. Man, Arnold's Pizza Shop, classic old internet stuff. Uh, am I playing season 3 of D4? Yeah, most probably. It would take a lot for me to not play it. Question is, how long will I play it for? So I played... Season 2 of D4, up until this Monday, I believe, was my last day playing it. Uh, which is a good amount of time. I imagine Season 3 won't hold me for as long. But I'd be pleasantly surprised if it does. Thank you, Caloroin. Oh, can I jump it? I can jump it. No, I can't jump it. Oh, bummer. A vicious strike. I will not do that. Gimmick of season 30 is the return of Soul Shards from season 25. We're not going to get any more new gimmicks anymore. Oh. 
Only time they're probably going to do anything brand new, if ever, and I mean if, if, that's a big if, would be like for like a 15th or 20th anniversary kind of thing. Ah, that's reasonable. Yeah, so we're a couple yeah. years away from that. Yeah, it, it, it's it's far enough in advance where the, the, somebody in different management would be like, that would sound like a good thing to do. Hmm. Probably somebody at Microsoft making the decision, but you know. It's gonna be like free cosmic wings for everyone who logs in. I mean, that would be one way to make everybody that still has the account mad. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> anytime you anytime you take away exclusivity from stuff, yeah, that's gonna piss a lot of people off. <laughs> you know how long I ground for that? Day in, day out, just trying to find a chest? <laughs> One pony? Oh, man. Good old days. I still don't have them. Yeah, same here. No cosmic wings. Nope. Decade of D3, no cosmic wings. That should... You know what? That should... That one... Alright, you know what? You know what? We should do, like, a charity stream one day. Oh, just 100% grind for the wings. <laughs> just to say, we like, we finally beat D3. Yeah, exactly. That's our. That is that is the end goal. That is like you know, it's like what MMOs is like. There's no end game. Like there's no actual ending to the game. Yeah, yeah our ending to D3, a live service game of some sort, is we got the cosmic wings. The sad thing, my odds at a Shaco are better than my odds at a cosmic wings. Ah, uh, yeah, it's true. Bell saying, not sure why they haven't added back that event that allowed you a small chance to get your missing cosmetics. I don't remember what that event is. Well, like there was an event for that? <laughs> huh. One thing I can think of with that is the freaking Menagerous I, Goblin when you're missing pets. I am unfamiliar with this sorcery that they speak of. Right? I am intrigued. Yeah. It's it's like vaguely ringing a bell, but like I know Final Fantasy fourteen has stuff like that, but that's an MMO, right? And that's not even stuff you missed. If you missed it, they put it up on their cash shop, and they're like, "You can pay us five bucks, <laughs> and we'll give you the glam." <laughs> like you can get it for free in the game if you play when you're in the game, and it's totally free. There's nothing extra for it. But if you missed it. It's in the cash shop. Buy it. That's reasonable. Yeah, it's, it's, and it's it's only after a year. Although I do think, hmm, if someone like was grinding for three years to get cosmic wings, and some guy spent five dollars in the cash shop to get them, like, I'd be oh, pissed. Oh yeah, that is. I think I'd be pissed. Yeah. <laughs> that that is that's at least a ten dollar purchase. Let me go. <laughs> <laughs> You get something from a greater rift, and when you opened it, it would mainly get bounty mats, but there was a really small chance to get the cost. Oh, the gift! The holiday gifts! Right! Yeah! They didn't do that this Christmas. It's true. Yeah. Huh. They chipped us. <laughs> <laughs> I absolutely hyped for last debug, Zubal. Yes. I think we're at Turn in for everything? Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Does everybody got space? I do. Yep. Okay. Clicking. Well done. Here is, there are more bounties for you in town. There are more bounties. Go do them. No, no, I'm good. No. No, no. Not again. We've done no, our I'm... job. <laughs> not anymore, no. Please, sir. Uh, no more. My mind is stronger. <laughs> We're not even doing another hardest difficulty, so we're not even guaranteed anything good. No. Oh, no, right, yeah. So it's done for purpose. All right. Maybe now I can actually do something. Eh. 
Eh, doing things is overrated. This is true. I've tried, tried for years. It's, you know, this never pays off. Uh, yeah, it's you know, a reasonable assumption, Phil. It's a reasonable assumption. I tried for years on the Cosmic Wings. Do you know how hard that is? <laughs> All right, got the gif. You got, you got to, you got to get. No, 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 no. So the the Hatrix gift. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, "What did you get?" No, 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 no. <laughs> All right, let's see. Uh, torment one, torment four for the key wardens. All right, I'm gonna bring us back I, to T four. I did not. Oh my god. What did you get? I got a ring of royal grandeur. Nice. <laughs> Man, I gotta get a ring of royal grandeur at some point. There is literally some sub seasons I won't get one until like my fortieth box. Oof. Yeah. Yeah. Like this one, I get it so stupid quick. Uh, this is not the last season of D3, but it might be my last season of D3. Nope. Came up with a pretty fun D4 sorcerer build around Hydra plus Lightning Sphere plus Chain Lightning and a Hound of Blasts. Awesome, man. Awesome. We gotta get crudest boots, man. Yeah, Nerfell's right. It's like the chances of getting cosmic wings is a percentage on a percentage on a percentage. Because it's a percentage to get a go uh, rainbow goblin to get in the zone. Then it's a percentage to get the actual NPC or the you know thing to pop. Yep. And then it's a percentage for it to drop from it. <laughs> Yep. <laughs> Not great odds. I mean, Toyoys did how many, like, hundreds or thousands with no... I think he got, like, at least two to three thousand Whimsy Shire, uh, uh, um, like, Rainbow Levels, and still yeah. no Cosmic Wings. Yeah, that's... Crazy. It's one of those, like... It's one of those, like, horror stories. It's like Battle Scars, like... This is when I. T this was my three hundredth run. Uh, <laughs> Greg, you still in game? Yeah, I didn't even notice you guys left. My bad. Yeah, no so, worries. I'm like, so when are we gonna remake this? Oh, <laughs> uh, we're doing T four. Okay, y'all can still carry that. Uh, yeah, you're good. Okay. You're good. <laughs> Oh, okay. So I don't know how many people have experienced this, but like when you play D uh, D three, they did something that I haven't seen in a lot of games that I think is kind of cool, where they have integration with your keyboard. So depending on your yeah. uh, light setup, they don't do that anymore, man. You know, like I was almost dead, and my entire keyboard was like flashing. At me, like, hey, idiot, you're about to die. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. They don't do, too. like, that is one of those things. They just don't, like, it's, it's like, too much work. They don't want to do it anymore or something. I don't know. Huh. That's odd. Yeah. And with, like, how synonymous, like, RGB is with everything, like, you'd think it'd be even more integrated than normal. Right. <clears throat> like... Like the ambient coloring thing behind TVs, which I still don't get why that's a thing, but okay. Saw just recently, actually, like today, uh, someone who had that set up, and like it was so bright, like the entire room was being lit up from the light behind the TV. Yeah. Okay, so you guys are still it's... wrecking on T4. What the heck, man? Uh, it's the Phantom Knives burst, that's it. Yeah, pretty much. Look, you knew it was going to be your last season. Even the Diablo gods looked at you and said, wait, you're really going to go monk, not Jane Hunter? <laughs> I've chosen poorly, you must, man. 
You must be punished. This is what I get for betraying my demon hunter roots. Pretty much. That's that. That literally, it wasn't even a question when we said it was this is the last one. I'm like, I'm going demon hunter. I can't <laughs> not. Russian dude, how you doing, man? Socket, huh? Alright, sock it to me. Oh, nice. Alright. It's not a poison weapon, though. My pets aren't doing anything yet. I really gotta get them crudest boots, man. Come on, Kadala, please. Please, Kadala. Ah, screw you, Kadala. <laughs> She's never gonna give you anything like that if you talk to her like that. Come on, now. <laughs> Silent Killer, I'm doing well. How are you, man? Uh, what's my highest good rift on my own and what torment? Uh. I know in groups I did GR 150. I don't remember if I ever did a GR 150 by myself. I don't. Uh, I never like tried to push very hard. Like I'll, I'll push a little bit maybe at the start of a season. Um, but the Greater Rift level is independent of the Torment level. Steampunk. Oh yeah. How you doing, Steampunk? Uh, all right. Who's heading towards what right now? I'm heading towards Azul. Okay. And then after that, we could probably all run the. I'm there right now. The NR. I never upgraded a rare to a legendary. What? Did you never upgrade an, uh, an item rick I did not. No. It's like my odds of getting something really beneficial to me are pretty low. That's a good point. And I guess I can try for a squirts necklace, but. Oh, yeah. That was a bounty, too. Nice. I need to go back. Going for focus and restraint would help, but uh, key warden's relatively close in Act One, so T minus five seconds. Had an order. I can see YouTube chat. What's up, Hood? I need spirit. What are my thoughts on the popularity of Last Epoch once it's fully released? So I think that Last Epoch will at least reach the popularity of Grim Dawn. Uh, I do not think Last Epoch will be able to exceed the popularity of Path of Exile. 
I believe that Last Epoch will be popular enough that the devs will be successful and able to maintain the game and continue to grow. And I believe they will be a known name in the ERPG space. Uh, I don't know that they will become a mainstream name uh, that is like known outside of, well known outside of the RPG space. But we already exist within a niche and pretty much the only names known, right? Like the average person outside of the RPG genre uh, like has heard of he Diablo. Works. Maybe they've heard of Path of Exile, but even then it's a little bit of a stretch. Port to Greg. Port to Greg? Port to Greg. Right oh, wow. That means Act 3 will be all the way at the end. Probably. Yeah, that's exactly Andy's Claws as a back cosmetic on Greg here, yeah. Had a few beers, Hood. Nice. What's your uh, what's your beer of preference? If Last Epoch has a bad launch, you think it could go the way of Wilson? I don't. Uh, I mean, is it within the realm of possibility? Maybe. Do I think it's? Uh, I I think it's exceptionally unlikely. Um, the team has been supporting the game so robustly. They've done so much testing. Um, they've already, like, proven a lot of stuff. I think if they do have a bad launch, they'll probably be able to recover relatively well. And I think they've built up a lot of good faith that people can... People will come back within, you know, the first, let's say six months or something. Um, a year max, and they'll be able to, to bounce back. Like, I think the, the the only thing that can really cause... Oh, my game just crashed. Cause troubles for Last Epoch would be um, servers. Let's say day one servers are... Like, it's a shit show. That would be the, the only real concern that I have. That, like, a ton of people come to try to play the game, and the servers are not prepared for that. the biggest problem with any game release now is like you have to temper expectation and not overcommit to something but at the same time you can't under commit to your stuff and poor to us we're just about the keyboard um because otherwise the experience will be so bad first taste is an impression that they can't person can't get over and then it's doa yeah, it's really tough to bounce back. Uh, we've seen it happen seldomly with some games, right? Like No Man's Sky is maybe one of the most famous examples. Mm -hmm. Cyberpunk. True, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, Final Fantasy XIV literally took down the servers for a year and we launched the game. Yeah. And it's been now going for over 10 years. Yeah. And it's one of the reasons why Square Enix is actually still in business. So. There you go. It's not impossible. It's just improbable. Fallout, yeah, Fallout seventy six to a degree. Fallout seventy six oh. is basically a niche thing. That... Uh, yeah, is the warden already here? Yeah, warden's already here. Oh <laughs> shit! Okay, going to going to go curious. Rig. I'm like, why is curious just chilling right here? Oh god, there he is. <laughs> uh, we are all present and accounted for. Kale, good kale, good kale. Well, now we got. Now we definitely got to run the rift. Run the rift. Yeah, we got to do a rift on torment. Yeah, we got to do a T uh, okay. one or higher. Uh, let's do the T four. Because we got to do the T four rift to unlock GR twenty anyway. True. Yeah, that's fine.
Still got Nems. I do. Oh, oh, damn it. That's okay. Next one. I don't have you enough spirit. Defeated. Yeah, I know that my shiny. checkpoints would be an actual challenge. You guys are going to breeze through yours. I'm going to be struggle busting my way. I've got no supporting items for my build. Well, what do you need besides focus and restraint? It's all the monk specific items. Well, yeah, with the way we're getting drops, though, I mean, which ones do you need? <laughs> uh, the crudest boots. I need uh, uh, bindings of the lesser god. Uh, I can use frostburn, uh, squirt's necklace. Uh, again, focus on restraint. Uh, Messer Schmidt's Reaver. I can use that. Um, I got the down here, by the way. Lefebvre's Soliloquy. Uh, where's Zeki and Arm Guards I can use? I can also use an Echoing Fury. I have heard troubling news. Uh, get ready for front door pain. From the oh, wow. Its members gather to the Mortar. Sounds exciting to me. Mortar shot on Cemetery. How does it feel playing D3 after playing D4? Does it make D3 better or 4? Um, the, the, again, so there's aspects of D3 that I prefer to D4, and there's things in D4 that I prefer to D3. Uh, when it comes to just, like, raw, arcadey, fun, fast progression kind of stuff, like D3, D3 wins there. Uh, D4 combat is a little bit more, like, thoughtful. Uh, I am coming with my NEMS. Did it work? Yeah. Right. Yep. So, like, having just the act of having the dodge in D4 combat makes things slightly more tactical and involved. I mean, I could, I sum it up as like, I feel like I'm actually doing something in D4. Like, in D3, it's just so quick shot go. Yeah. That it's almost like a second nature thing. Like, it cannot be done. Has raised me to new D3 much more spammy. Yeah. I need spirit. Like, again, if all you're looking for is a game to just, like, chill with, you know, play some music and maybe watch Netflix at the same time, just fly through levels and let items drop, like D3 wins there. Gotta give it a blizzard for that D4. Uh, that D4 had good servers on launch. Yeah, yeah. It was a very, very smooth launch for D4. I think they learned something after all the years of World of Warcraft on how to fucking manage some servers when they launch. Yeah. Yeah. Not enough spirit. I can still remember the pain of the uh, Sim City launch. Ugh. The game was like unplayable for at least two days on launch. Oh man. To the point where they actually, EA ended up giving people free games as, or, or we're sorry. Oh no. Ah yes, because SimCity, a city building game, needs to be operated online 100% of the time. <laughs> oh yeah. Am I doing an over slash under on what the 24 hour peak active users will be for last epoch on launch? Or do you have a guess on how much uh, it'll hit on launch? Um, I could, oh, I'll set item. I don't have one, like, already in mind. I, 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 we can pause it. Um, oh, I happen to get in this. What is their current peak concurrence? What is their current peak concurrent for uh, for Last Epoch? What was Wilson's peak concurrence? Was it, like, 120? 120k? One down. Let's see. Steam charts uh, last epoch. 
Their all-time peak is 40k. Okay, let's see. Wilson. Wilson's all-time peak was 127k. And let's see. Path of Exiles. All-time peak was 200k. So the question is, can they beat... It's gonna be, I think it's going to be tough to beat Wilson's peak concurrence. Wilson came at a time when there was no D4 yet. Wilson over-promised and under-delivered. Wilson looked truly next-gen. Wilson looked like it was going to be a D4 killer. Um... For those who know ARPGs, Last Epoch looks like an amazing game. Uh, but for like average Joe gamer who's just looking at screenshots, Last Epoch doesn't look like a next gen, like crazy good graphics game the way that Wilson did. So I wonder if that might cause it to uh, not reach the same. peak audience as Wilson. So I think it's going to really come down to the streamers, honestly. It's how many PoE streamers and Diablo streamers and ARPG streamers like, as you know, is Asmongold, is Quinn, is Zizarin, and all the big names going to come and stream Last Epoch at launch? If so, then I think it could beat Wilson. But if you took out that factor, I don't think it would be able to beat Wilson's numbers. So part of that comes down to February 20th. When is the next Path of Exile League starting? I don't think it's going to interfere. No, ooh, it might. Hold not a on. bit. It, you say not a Path bit? Path of Exile? Yeah. Path of Exile just started a new league about three weeks ago. They have some intermittent items in between that they'll be doing during it, but their, season, their leagues normally last three to four months. Okay, so there will not be interference there then. As a matter of fact, it'll be so deep in the league, uh, Path of Exile, I wouldn't doubt that many people will give it a shot. Yeah, they're going to be done with the season in Path of Exile. Makes sense. Yep. Ah, Blackthorn's Boots, nice. So they are launching at what would be a very advantageous time for them to do so in the ARP genre. Yeah, right, because they had content. delayed it from December because they didn't want to conflict with with uh, PoE, right? That was PoE launch, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's kind of like Diablo is smart by launching this season for D3 now because, I mean, it's not super depth for content, so, you know, you can burn through it in, like, a couple days or a week, and then D4 is ready to go. All right, let's split to do our uh, GR 20s. You guys are going to breeze through it. I am possibly going to fail. Let's find out. What's the best way to level up solo this season? Same as always. Um, what you want to do is you go to the Darkening of Tristram on normal difficulty. You go and grab... You, you go to level 5. And you're going to look for this thing on the ground that's going to drop a bunch of gems. With that, you upgrade the Altar of Rites, second tier, to make it such that items have no requirement anymore. Use the Challenge Rift reward to then craft yourself a bunch of level 70 gear, and you just laugh your way through the regular methods, but much faster. Yeah, you guys can message me. Uh, Discord.gg slash Riker is, uh, is our Discord server. From there, you can find me to, if you want to shoot me a DM. So, playing in a team is faster, but even if you're playing solo, it could still go pretty fast. Definitely, like, feasible under two hours. What do you think of Diablo Immortal? First time ever playing Diablo game on a phone. Is the hate justified? In my opinion, it has exceeded my expectations for a phone game. Uh, yeah, so the, your last sentence there is how I felt. At the time, like, it blew me away that that could be a phone game. Uh... The only thing, well, okay, so there's two things that I that I I'm not crazy about when it comes to Immortal. One is the monetization. 
and two is it's more of an MMO than an ARPG, and I'm just not that into MMOs. Okay, wish me luck. Guess it's going okay so far, but... Uh -oh. I immediately take that back. It is not going okay. Mistakes were made. Mistakes were made! Oh, my gear is lost, so I can't. Well, at least I can benefit from the shield. Alright. The, um... The ingum, though, is super helping me. Holy crap. It's like the only good item that I have. I got the I got my favorite level in fact. I got some nice ones. I got the forest one where immediately like three rare mobs run at you. Nice. I got that one with like oh God, what is it? The one with the flame spouts. Ew. I know that's undescriptive because there's like fourteen to do, but The game running at 30 like FPS. Um, I'm at 86 right now, but I do tend to have FPS issues in D3. Even in, even with your 48. It's it's not about the video card. This is some I don't know what it is. I've always had an issue where uh, something is causing performance problems. Like on paper, there's no reason I like I should be getting 144, and I'm just not. <laughs> it cannot be done. Easy peasy, done with mine. Nice. Oh, we see. Oh, I got a ramalama dinglingies. Oh, of course. <laughs> it is not ready yet. I need spirit. And the yellers are tough. Yeah, I'm living and dying on my fan of knives right now. What's making me move so slow? Look, I'm trudging through molasses here. Oh, it would've been nice to have this against the Rift Guardian. Rift Guardian is a tough fight for me. Good thing I'm gonna have a lot of time left for it. Hopefully. I'm not even at 50% on my Rift yet. Oh wow, okay. I'm at 67-ish. Like I said, I got bad layouts. Oh, a better level, nice. It cannot be done. Although I say nice, but now this is more deadly for me. What you ask is impossible. I need 
79. I must wait to use that ability. The gods favor me. It cannot be done. Joe Luis saying, I don't think I actually learned anything from the launch of D4. The audience was just split because they gave early access to pre-orders. Uh, that did lessen the strain on launch day, for sure. Oh, 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 no, no. Oh, I popped the potion, uh, my power just in time. Oh, don't die. Uh... You could also argue that's the industry standard nowadays. Like, most games will, like, if you pre-order... A legendary edition or something like you get early access but really those are your diehard fans you're trying to impress anyways so yeah it's probably a smart business move to just be like hey do you like the game <laughs> do you think you're gonna like the game ah oh, come on so close 97 how are you doing on time? Like, do you think you're going to run out of time? I'm at 70%. Oh, okay. You're fine, though. And time-wise, I'm not even at 50, so... I would argue I'm not concerned. 77 now. Okay, so the only I'm reason you were, quote, behind me is just because you started after me. That, too. But also, I... Uh, I'm on floor four. Oh wow. Yeah, that's yeah. some bad luck. Yeah, I have not had it. It's not been a good time. And I just got my second pylon. So I haven't even been getting pylon luck either. Pop them. There we go. Alrighty. Oof. Oh, that was a struggle. Coca-Cola Liker. Seven month resub. Hope you're doing well. Alrighty. And now we can get the last of our set. Muffin saying, they didn't even notice, we just said a GR-77 right up from GR-45 and got Trag Scythe as a primal. Oh, congrats. Nice. Thal saying, we hate challenge trips, so we will likely not open ours so we don't have to do it again next week. That's fair. That's a reasonable strategy. Well, this week's was pretty rough. <laughs> there you go, Armageddon. Yeah, this was a tough one for those who don't know how to play Jade. Yeah, for sure. Never done it, so I have no idea. I played D3 on the Switch, not D2R. Yeah, no, I was really surprised at how well uh, D3 played on Switch. I wonder if Goopy Goldberg ever got D4 running on her app while her rent was hilarious. Yeah. I got, I don't know, I got a feeling that uh, she is not. In fact, play oh, it was Justice. It. Yeah, she is not, in fact, playing D4. Yeah. Alright, so is, who who's not done? Just dude, or did you finish now? I just finished. Did you guys re-party? I'm not in a party with them. Ah, oh, okay. Did I, I close? Yep, okay. A new recruit 
has joined my party. I had to double check that I had already closed my rift just in case I left without doing so and being like, no. <laughs> yeah, basically, Adrian Dolorosa. Yeah, basically. That was uh, quite the day. Okay, so now let's do them visions. All right, and speaking of, instantly hey, got one. Go. Give me one sec here up there. Oh, actually, I should have put my tricks of lies. Who's in it right now? No one, just port to Greg though. He'll come to all of us. God damn. Okay. Well, here, let's go. My mind is stronger. Oh, and we're just on T4. I should have bumped us up to T6 first. Whoops. Well, after this one. Guys are going so quick, we're not even getting drops. All right. Yeah, we especially want to get like those levels with the bosses because the bosses will drop a bunch of things. All right, next level. Almost there. Almost there. I will not do that. Got it. He left us. Darius is taking all the stuff for himself. <laughs> it cannot be done. I don't like that. Alright, so this is the last floor. So hold off on opening the chest. Okay. It's up, too. I've already got a set item on it. Alright. Is everyone ready for chest? I guess, yeah. Alright, pop it. Some bounty mats from that. That's nice. I'm returning to town. That's nice. Ooh, another ember. I have gotten zero embers, man. Same. I haven't gotten those. I don't even know what they are. Uh, they upgrade the essences and whatnot. I don't believe you. I've never seen one. <laughs> Here, let me identify it real fast. I'll show you. Nope. Nope. Big news. You know, it's this cool little thing. See that? No, that's that's you just hack the game. It's fine. See? Nope. Hack the game. See? You spammed it. That's now I know now I know you're hacking the game. <laughs> yeah. We didn't get any uh, blood shirts. I guess we don't get blood shirts from 
these. No. Not a convention of elements. Another one. Got a visage of goons. Oh. Uh, uh, There's a chain of shadows for you vault. <laughs> vault demon hunters. Cam's rebuttal, look at that. What's wrong with vault? I don't know. I don't like vault. I always, if I am given the option, I always go smokescreen. So, whoever wants that chain of shadows can have it. Oh, where is it? Elements. All right, there you go. Perfect. The new Vault Monk build. <laughs>Depositing the chain of shadows in town. And, uh, well, I'm just gonna start hunting for a vision of enmity. Tonight is a strawberry margarita. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, things hurt on T10. My understanding grows. Thank you for the cheers. Uh Selunevd. Selunevd. I will not do that. Crusader Recon is such a bait. This is the worst XP I've ever had. Oh man. My strength has increased. What are you not liking about it? Just had a Necro Season 30 on Nintendo Switch. Nice. Portals, you just go to the heavily densed areas, right? Isn't it? I'm doing Act One bounties. I figure I'll hopefully run into it as I'm doing something productive. I don't know how many of you still need uh, Ring of Royal Grandeur. <laughs> yes. You know I'm good. Yeah. <laughs> whale, whale, whale. I mean, well, I was doing the bounty in Act 4. I guess that's kind of pointless. I should probably go to Act 5, or 1. I'll do the Curse Chest in Act 1. <laughs> but yeah, this does hurt a lot.
How do you fix the Akan? Condemn Phalanx, clear. The clear feels awful, and only one shot bosses, but clear is gross. Uh, so I haven't played the Phalanx variant myself. So off the top of my head, I'm not sure. Uh, Dr. Beats, are you following the the Max Roll Guide? I got a portal on me. Ah. Um, and an EXP shrine right next to us, too. Haha. -ha. Well, right? well, talk. Cool. Tickety talk. Daniel. Hook's afraid of an old dead croc. Hook's afraid of T-I-M-E. Slipping away. Hope you're doing well, Daniel. Alright, important to Greg. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It is, it is worse than the classic, for sure, Dr. Beats, yeah. Are we all here? Yeah, okay, cool. Mm -hmm. Did we already spawn the chest? Yep. Ooh. Wow, that was lame. Okay, hold on. Before we open it, let's... Is there anything? Is there monster in here? Trying to find elites. No. Ow. All right. Oh, my elites are falling. Yeah. That was a horrible one. Cannot be done. <laughs> Dang, okay. Pop it, I guess. One and done. Mm, so we got bounty materials, I guess. That's yeah, the fastest bounty stuff I've ever gotten. Yeah. <laughs> Can't really argue with speed. Yeah, it was a good movie. <laughs> Unrealistic, though. Going 55? Why so slow? Dennis Hopper was not as smart as he thought he was in that movie. I it The gods favor me. Alloy wishes Veers was a little less clunky because of my favorite set thematically. The dopamine hit when you transform. Jared pushing wise, Necro Blood Nova for sure. Nice, nice, nice. How do you feel about the uh, reverse Archon? I can never. I don't know. Like, I feel that makes it especially clunky. I like classic fear. Big deeps when I'm able to pop my my mystic allies when I'm waiting on the cooldowns. Get out, get out, get out. Yeah. And don't forget to check on your uh, altar of rights periodically. See what you can upgrade. That's what I literally just did, because you need 10 dBs and a uh, greater rift key for the next upgrade. Ah. Uh. Classic, of course. Nice. And then after that, any set helm. Ah. Sacrifice one you got. Something. Well, I was going to check it because I crafted one. And I want to see if that works. Oh. Uh, can you use nope. a crafted one? No. Short answer is no. Yeah. That's how they get you. Custos saying this build seems very fun. I'm not doing bad on D4 Barbarian, but I wish there was something like this on D4. Yeah, it's a fun one. When you do the set dungeon, I'll wait until I get the gear for the easiest set. I don't think I want to try the inner dungeon again. <laughs> yeah, some of them are distinctly 
easier than others. Essence of anguish is like my uh oh some somebody got the portal. Probably yep. curious. Are we good to um turn in bounty? Uh yes, I'm just good. in case you get your rog. And we get the rog. No. Double Dang mace. It. Oof. I got double shoulder. I got an ambulance. You got what? I got a, I got an amulet. Ah. Uh. I got a rock. <laughs> this page, cultist page, get out of here. Don't need a cultist page. Okay, who's got the enmity? I'm guessing it's curious. Yeah, I think it's, yeah it looks like. Yep. It is. Gotta be. Okay. Break beneath the endless tide. It cannot be done. My path becomes clearer. Mm -hmm. hey, there we go. Legendary potion. My path becomes clearer. It is not ready yet. Oh. I have been healed. Next level. I must wait to use that ability. This fight is over. Yeah, the difficulty ramps up in these relative to just like. Oh my god, seriously? What happened? Ah, what the heck? <laughs> Jades. It saw how much you enjoyed it in the challenge rift. I got caught by something. How you doing, Goose? It is not ready yet. Your no. Not even oh, oh, shit. No, I, I know, I missed it too. I can't go back, can I? No. I had a legendary right on top of the spawn yeah, point. Yeah, I had two. <laughs> At least they weren't good. I don't, I don't think they were good. The well, mine was a belt. I would have loved that. Who is that hell? Okay. I need spirit. <sighs> Holy crap, I'm like dying left and right now because Difficulty really ramps up. Yeah, don't go down yet, please. I have a bunch of shit to get. Has raised me to new heights. There we go. <laughs> All right, good to go down. Used to play Jades long ago, but I never played Jades like that. Oh, you mean like poorly? Yeah. It wasn't Sorry. a well-optimized Jade. Oh, set item, what is it? Boots. I'm getting like one shot by everything. Ow. Nishad has raised me to new heights. Yeah, going down. I must wait. I feel like we don't get as many lucky levels as Oh, that's uh I just got a double Ooh. Whoa, I got four drops. What the heck? Yeah, yeah, I was about to say I got three. <laughs> Racers, quiver, up oh, four. I don't what the heck? Just as I'm saying, we don't get lucky levels and <laughs> And I got a consumable! A red consumable. Well, you Is that an ember? Oh, yeah, it's yeah. an ember. An nice. And a legendary. Good oh lord. My gosh. Okay, this is the best level. Let's keep killing stuff here. Some actually weird luck is happening. On other levels so far. Yeah, and I got another legendary. What the fuck? What is happening here? Yeah. Oh, another set item. 
I'm getting three to four legendaries per level at this point. Oh, another legendary. I just got my fifth one, yep. I am just dying like non-stop right now. <laughs> I've gotten eight uh, this one so far. Ice on the ground is not helping anybody's situation, I'll tell you that. Can over here can in this down. corner. So I got some Nams, a Carly's point. Nice. All right, next level. Skyrim shuffle. Oh, fist weapon. Okay. Another two or three legendaries dropped. Yeah. Okay. Legendary crossbow. Bracers. Could they be the ones that I need? Oops, and crossbow. Quiver. Man, things ramped up. <laughs> Dead. In. Waiting for the down. Heading down. Going down. Oh, this is a good one. This is what I was hoping for. All the blues to get all the, the DVs. Oh my. Uh, I have about seven drops on the ground right now. <laughs> Do not go down. My mind is stronger. Okay. I'm good. Everybody else good? Yeah, yeah. I'm good. Go. On. Probably final floor. I must wait you to are use that ability. More bracer. <laughs> Four legendaries already. Oh yeah, I'm at five. My frame Turns rate is at blood... 20. Yeah, blood sacrifice is help by the look of it. Just kill yourself a lot. <laughs> Game takes pity on you. Pretty much. Hey, I thought it was the last gonna be... level. It's not the last level, yeah. I need to grab here. Okay. Let's uh, keep scouting around. See if there's Does anyone need to make a stop in town? Oh, legendary. I do. Yeah, I'm a yellow. Yeah, I was about to say. I, yeah. I'll teleport back to town here in a second. Be done. Take a mid break here. Oh. Yeah, I'm just getting one shot by everything pretty much. So I'm going back to town right now. Okay, I'm gonna head back to town and salvage some stuff. I'm returning to town. I need nothing. <clears throat> Wait, you can go back up? How do you go back up? Just be able to click on the portal, can't you? I think he meant on town. Ah. I thought you could just click on the portal and go back up a floor, couldn't you? There's certain floors you can't do that on. Ah, okay. Yeah, I've got four Hellfire Embers from that so far. Nice. Yeah. Dude, right. you said you're going for a UE build, right? Yeah. Well, you got... Oh, you got UEs? Yeah, there's a couple there for you. Okay. Are you not running uh Nah, anything? if anything, I'll do Impale or the Sentry build. Or maybe I'll try Natalia's, I don't know. I got Clarity Wraps if anybody wants Ooh. them. Doink. There you go. Good trade, good go. trade, good trade. Good <laughs> trade. Uh, I gotta salvage some shit here. Ooh, I only need uh, Compass Rose. No, not yet. Well, I got a holy point shot. Oh, I got a rest I got a restraint. Are you needing focus and restraint? Yep. I'll give you my restraint then. Thank you. Because I'm not gonna need it. Uh, I think I'm just gonna drop in I'm just gonna pop it in a Spot and go. It's too much to think about right now. I need to get back to the killings. Oh, yeah. Although I do have an ancient compass rose now. That's good. Okay, yeah, so sometimes there's a doorway to go back up through. Like, in this case, we could go back, but the, yeah, on the no previous point. level that we were on, 
on the one you and me misclicked on there's no it's it looks oh, like oh wait bearded saying one. all of them have doors to go up but sometimes oh i guess it's not obvious because it's made to wait, look what? thematic there's one that like we were like right above a staircase that we couldn't re-click to go back on that's what i thought Oh well, either way, we're way, we're like well past it now, so it don't matter. Yeah, like that would be hard fishing at this point. So I'll be there in a second. Sorry, just sorting some stuff out still. Mix saying he hasn't hit a single floor that he can go back on. Sometimes it just looks like a door instead of a portal. Hmm. Well, I'm trying to pay more attention, I guess. Yeah, as I say, we'll, we'll hopefully we'll get another example of it. Cause yeah, on other ones we've seen, we can go back on, but. That one both you and me freaked out on, so. Alright, yeah. going down. Going down. Going down. Holy shit, the drops. Yeah, done. Uh, I'm up to six so far. How about y'all? Not that many. Just the one. I took a break this, uh, this <laughs> level. I got a mojo. Pray we for jo -Jo -Jo? mojo. Going down. Down. This has got to be the last level. This has got to be. Set shoulders. Nope. Holy guacamole. Uh, shit. I got to... Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Don't go down, please. Something is on the ground and it likes... More legendaries. Uh, mm -hmm. Sliver of Terror. Oh, nice. Yeah. What I'm using in my head right now. I'm good to go. Good to go. Good to go. Good to go. Go, go, go. This is making... There's still going to be another, too. Good lord. <laughs> this is making up for the one shot we had earlier. Right. Yeah. Oh, Remnant of pain, nice. I will not do that. Oh, Riker six. the Reckoner, huh? Ooh, Ramalama Dingleys. Better kill that guy. Yeah, he's a never do well. Never do well. A delinquent. Just screaming the entire time, lore. Um, <laughs> the belts. Nice. He sounded just like Going down. Dane. One, two, three, go. Gabby. Uh, all right, so don't kill the Gabby yet, but yeah, this is gonna be the last one. Shit. Uh, it's yeah, that's that's box. Got another two legendaries and an anguish. My strides grow longer. All right. I think that is it. Are we clear? I'm good. I'm good to open also. Pop it a lot. GRG. Only one legendary from that. What is this? Come on. <laughs> I need to go back. I don't know. Yeah, appreciate ya. Hope you're doing well. Does anything special happen when Riker kills Riker? Well, you tell me. Not that I've noticed. Time pair. Time paradox. Time paradox. There you go. My hardcore solo the worst character and see how far I get. So what's the worst character in season 30 for D3? Anyone remember off the top of their head? Uh, LOD Rat Mage. For uh, Necromancer. Ah, potions. Someone needs a ram lama ding -lingies. Look, I got so many of them. I'm already up to two, so I'm good. Got an ancient buff belt. Realms buff butt. Buff butt. Hey, I got UE shoulders as well, but some three out of five, uh, three out of six now. Well, technically nice. five. Got a dawn. Ooh, a dawn. Yeah. Yeah, you need that though for your build. Dawn. I need that, yeah. Yeah. From a UE set. So that's lovely. Anybody want a witch doctor offhand? No. Yeah. <laughs> Why is it with no. Stingy people.
I mean, that's a resource spending attack, and that's hitting enemies, right? This is very true, Lil. Yeah, this is very true. <laughs> oh, boy. Alright, well, I'll grab a potion. Uh, okay, I guess I'll... Unless someone was working on bounties of a different act. We'll, uh... Although, at this point... Uh, hmm. Like um, let's do a GR. What's the highest GR we can do? I'm gonna just burn the rest of my GR keys. How's the weather out there? Uh, it's 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 negative eight for you. I think it's milder for it's negative six for us. I'm gonna cancel this right quick because I'm trying to click OK on a skill. But no worries. Yeah. Away. Yeah. Cancel that. There we go. Now I'm good. Okay. To go. I'm canceling it. Cool. Cancel. Suck. Yeah. Sorry, I'm still... I got I got a manticore, so I'm like, oh, time to go cluster arrow. Ah. No, I am still salvaging too much crap. Ah, yeah, good old days, well. I figured we'd get the gang back together, uh... <laughs> one more den. Once more under the breach. Did you say... Did you see me say that phrase at the beginning? No. I said that, like, literally, that was one of the first things I said when I came into <laughs> chat today. <laughs> ah, nice. Quit copying me, man. What are you doing? <laughs> Guys. Let me be me. Uh, uh, I guess I can do Sliver of Terror instead. It does right. a bunch of damage. Worst guy's ready to go. Alright, T5. Oh yeah, we're gonna breeze them. 22 Rift. Yeah, we just Probably. did T10, like... More Rikers. Aha, finally! Something I'm doing is better than the neck the Demon Hunters. I can move fast! Yeah, you can. And I just got us a power shrine because i wasn't thinking that you had nems on still oh i only have nems for it. regular rifts so it's fine oh okay cool yeah because I, I gotta swap to them I'm locked in these Ah, feels good to be fast. I would like that shrine, but... No soup for you. Somebody popped it before we were on the floor. Hey, we're rank 97. <laughs> With a G. <laughs> oh, gosh. All right. So that means how how high can we climb in like the next five minutes? The next five minutes? I got five GR keys. Let's see. We we just hit rank ninety seven. So uh, I mean, bump it to a fifty and see how we do. <laughs> that's the thing. We can't like we got to slow climb. It is a problem. Oh, that's right. I can do a twenty five. I mean, okay, if we do a regular rift here, we'll do a regular rift first, and then we can at least open a T ten one. Yoink. 
Especially with a conduit shrine up, Jesus. Get your wow memes out of here, curious. Did anyone just? <laughs> just... Don't we ban oh, people yeah. for that still? If you do a regular rift, it won't let you do a higher grade of rift. Wait, what? What do you mean? If you do a, a regular rift, you unlock that tier of greater rift. Like, if you do a Torment 4 regular rift, you can do, you unlock a tier uh, 20 yeah. GR. So, doing uh, a, t a, t a Torment 10 should be like a 40, I think? Something like that. Oh, there was a blood gooby. Brendan the Brubarian. Two months recent. Happy partner anniversary. Hey, cheers. Hope you're doing well. Negative 47 in Calgary this morning. Yikes. Yikes. Yeah, that's coming my way. Yikes. Not looking forward to it. <laughs> it's a little brisk. Yeah, so don't go outside, weather. Back no, here. I see a legendary oh. all the way back Yeah, there. me too. Yeah. <laughs> Which we was all got like the a, same drop. Was it a miscreant? Oh, is nope. that what happened? Nope. It was just a mob. Like, it was nothing. It was just a chest. It looked like a oh, chest. Oh, a open. chest. Okay. What you ask is impossible. The real root nine. What's up, man? Shard right here, too. Yoink. For an essence. I like Sentry Build, but it's not built for gameplay of multiplayer. Nope. Or moving fast. Yeah. It's not a Sonic build for sure. Sonic. That's why we got to get into Sanic. the GRs where I'm going to slow down and you guys are going to do all the killing and I'm going to do nothing. Son, I gotta burn some. I gotta burn some shirts. Andrew, Andrew. Yeah. Favorite pet? The cabot is hilariously cool. The Seraph one is pretty cool too. Yeah, I kind of rotate them uh, depending on. Like, I try to make them match with my transmog, but uh, uh, not this guy. Uh, this guy I like to use sometimes. Not him. Uh, he's pretty cool. No, no. Um, yeah, I like this guy sometimes. Um, I, you know what? I haven't really used that guy, but I like him. Oh, this is my favorite pet. I forgot. Yeah. Queen of the Succubi. Uh, he's pretty cool. I like the... I like the, the StarCraft ones. Oh, this is a new one. Father Mercus. Uh, I like this one as well. It's classic Diablo. When did I get this guy? When did I get Malganis? What? <laughs> I'm not mad. I'm just confused. This one's also pretty cool. Do I have Malganis? I don't know how I got Malganis. Yeah, what the hell is Malganis from? I have Malganis as well. Huh. Well, I mean, it's a WoW character, so you'd figure about it. Oh, I'd have it now. Don't forget, luck always changes. I cannot catch more. Don't know. Dancers, World of Warcraft, or Warcraft character, yeah. You look like you could use a new item. Do come back again. How's the uh, ping been, um, curious?
That bad, huh? I was about to say, yeah, he hasn't heard it yet. <laughs> It's about 350. Oh shit, sorry. You were in it, um... Well, now I'm really good to close. So. <laughs> oh, good roll. Well, terrible roll, but I at least got my Yangs now. Oh, nice. But the problem is I'm still running... I'm not running to UE yet, so... Uh, Warcraft but... 3 Forge Collector's Edition? Could it be that? Did I get that? that? Sense. Plausible. I got that. I do not have that because I didn't play Warcraft. Yeah, I don't remember getting. <sighs> hmm. Yeah, it's a ter it's a terrible roll. It was a one fifty six out of two hundred roll. I go re roll it in the cube once. Oh yeah, yeah. Wait, you can wait. Re roll cube re roll. Which one? Yeah, there's a reforge uh, legendary, which it takes like fifty freaking. Uh, Oh yeah, Forgotten Souls yeah. fifty. Mm. Takes a lot, but pretty much all my Forgotten Souls so far. So, but it can't be any worse. <laughs> dot dot dot. <laughs> dot dot dot. I'm using a special key. You need to have a mouse oh that's a special God. spot to teleport through the wall. Did I get one fifty three or something? No, I got one fifty one. Oh <laughs> wow! That hurt. That hurt. Dang. I actually Stop failing if I try something easy like jumping across the gap on the way to... Um, so, it's nothing special clicking-wise. It's just kind of... You get a sense of where you gotta put the mouse, how far you gotta be. It's especially most difficult, um, in my opinion, when you're trying to port down a slope. Oh my god. I can no longer bring enough damage. I can now at least sustain hatred, so that's good. We are we are blasting though, look at this. It is not ready yet. My strides grow longer. My understanding grows. Yeah, we can probably finish it on this level. Who's got it? I must wait. My mind Pew. We just get rank 45? 47. Uh, no, we got rank 45 on the leaderboard. Oh, rank 45. Oh, tier 47, yeah. Oops. Yeah, Missed yeah. Problem. All right. right, we got to keep going. Nope. Got some Here shards we go. to spend real fast. Should be able to close it. I'll get them by the time it's ready. Uh, it closes instantly, though. Oh, yeah, all right. That's, uh... Yeah. Uh... Ancient Natty is a shadow coil. Uh... Ancient Holy Point shot. Ooh, holy point shot. I'll take that if you don't want it, because I plan on probably running the uh, Impale set. Here, it's an ancient one, too, so. Ooh, thank you. That will more than good you. Good. Good, good, good. I'm good to close, too, whenever. Hey, another ember. Oh, they're not doing my right. gems. I can have a level three gem already. Well, I've got... I can roll two level three gems right now if I wanted. Nice. Yeah, I didn't realize it when you guys were talking about it. I'm like, yeah, I've got another, I've got another three hell four gembers sitting, and I've got a level three on my head right now. Oh, nice. So, eh. I'm just trying to figure out what to put in my weapon. How do I... I guess I right-click... Only use it on a soul shirt. Okay. Oh, come on. Hmm. 
I don't think there's anything good to put in the weapon. Oh, what a bad. Yeah. What a bad. I'm gonna go look at the altar of rights because I think I can get a few spots. It's a meet. Happy Friday. Hope y'all are doing great. Forgot the name of that build. And can you also explain to me how to fix my game from saying season state unknown? Oh, that sounds odd. Connect I to the internet. don't know. Huh. Uh, the build I'm running is uh, in a mystic ally. In a mystic ally. It cannot be done. Alright, next offering I need is all the shit from the Uber. Who hasn't done their gems? Oh, uh, shit, that's probably me. Let me double check. forgot about jams I guess I do have jams I have another GR70 yet now we're we're uh, climbing the GRs now okay. I do a 50 oh dang little death zero okay so you're playing on Xbox you're saying huh sorry I went to click the Accept button and something else popped up. I was like, ah. All right, let's cancel out. All right, good. Good now? Yep. All righty. Jumping up to a 50. Hey, doing, Anthony? Are you strong enough to. I crave equip that ability is not yet to be found. Instant. Boom. Destruction. I kind of wish I had a rucksack, because... My understanding grows. What you ask is impossible. My mind is stronger. Is your mind stronger? Go down. No one's got an M's, right? The storm breaks. Correct. I does not. It is not ready yet. My understanding grows. Not sure how I've sped up again, given I am not really any more powerful. Oh, I guess maybe is this the power of the dregs of lies leveled up to three? It's the only thing I really changed. What do you got? You got a good roll on it? No, I got the on death thing. I will not do that. I got a, I got a guy here, and he killed me. It cannot be done. What a dick! <laughs> Sasha. Yeah, yeah, Woody Paragon, a thousand. I believe it. I believe it. Well, he's a you. I mean, he. 
He's been at it for like what? 13 hours? 10 hours? 13, yeah. There's no way to mod D3, no. Maybe cosmetically. Yeah, I get banned. Client side stuff. Oh yeah, you'll do <laughs> TOC breaking. I don't think that's up for debate. That's that's a guaranteed right there. Uh, big Chef Nasty, I'm curious. Since the release of Season 2 of Diablo 4, do you feel the game is slowly moving in the right direction longevity-wise? Yeah, it's been steadily improving. Like, there's still a lot of work to do, but they, they've been improving the game. Season 2 is a big win overall, like, relative to Season 1. You think it's hard to remember all the different systems between the different ERPGs that you play? Um, yeah, like, I, so I, I definitely don't... 100% remember everything from every game. Like, I mo I, I'm mo, most familiar with D3, then D4, um, and then, like, Pewee and Last Epoch are, like, like Pewee, there's still th systems that I don't know. Um, Last Epoch, there's stuff that I don't remember, but I also haven't been, like, pushing Last Epoch hard. I've been waiting for release. Torchlight Infinite... I'm 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 getting to a point where now where it's like okay, I'm remembering things. This is what I gotta do here, right? Okay, where do we just get on leaderboards there? We just hit. No, not we so lowered. Low. We're now rank sixty-five. We just get bumped down. Uh huh. Son of a bitch, Dread Scythe, Dread Scythe and Knight. Okay, we gotta beat these guys. We gotta. We gotta. Oh, they're playing. <laughs> it's just now become personal. Yeah, I say now we got a reason. <laughs> Although that's like Canadian on Canadian violence. I don't know if I'm okay with that. So. <laughs> oh, now I'm not doing any damage anymore. Oh. Elite here. God, I really, with how quick we're going, I really wish I had my full UEs right now. Power pile Another on. Riker. <laughs> That's like five Rikers we found. How long have I been interested in Blizzard? Oh, uh, since I was a kid. Like, StarCraft 1, Warcraft 2, Diablo 2. Yeah, it's, it's when I fell in love with Blizzard. My love with blizzard started at rock and roll racing oh nice so i i didn't play rock and roll racing i didn't know it was blizzard at the time i enjoyed the game oh yeah like a couple years ago when they announced they were doing the whole uh arcade and it was that game gonna be on there i was like oh. <laughs> uh i was around since warcraft not warcraft 2 Warcraft. Oh yeah. Also, although it didn't help that I lived next door to the home base, so. Right. Okay. In That's hindsight, still that is pretty good time. Wild. All things to think about. You, you were there for the inception. I was. Well, I think it's funny because I have a. I have a box. Rank forty nine. Uh, okay. There we go. Um. I have a box that's signed by a bunch of uh, the Warcraft three developers. For Warcraft 3's launch. Oh, nice. They were, they were, a bunch of the devs were sitting at a GameStop um, at the Irvine Spectrum and doing signings. So I'm like, hmm. okay. Whale, whale, whale. I'll go. It cannot it's also where I had my pre-order too, so. Yeah. Ah. Kind of made sense. But I haven't checked to see if any of them are still there. Ah. <laughs> Likelihood? Limited. Ah, uh, yes. Yeah, nothing like getting Talrasha's source on a demon hunter. Awesome. Beautiful. Okay. 
Okay, I need to let's see here. Ooh, restore this fire. Ancient Manticore. Let's go. Nice. My strength has increased. Oh, I need the most of uh, your gold boots real quick. There's another piece of uh, UE for you. Which that one? Ancient chest piece. And I just got Hellwalker boots, so I think I got enough to switch with Rogs. Yeah, I do. Nice. Thank you. Mm hmm. As someone who's lost interest in season one, would you recommend me giving it a second chance? Because I did somewhat enjoy D4. Uh, at this point, I think we should see what season three is. Uh, but, like, trying out season two definitely would have been worth it. At this point, it's too late to try out season two. And I, we cannot guarantee that season three will be good yet, but we're going to find out about it next week. I mean, at the end of the day, like, you paid for the game. Assuming you didn't get a refund, it's worth, you know, every now and then revisiting to see if you enjoy the game more. Yeah, too many people, when they, like, stop playing a the game, they just put it down hard, cold turkey kind of thing. Like... Should go back to it occasionally. Mm -hmm. Seems changed. That too, but also, I mean, things don't like. It might not be as much fun as like day one stuff, but like you know, mm. it's not terrible by any means. Still and probably still enjoyable to a degree. Nice little death. Cool. Sash is saying, "I love your lore videos." Hey, glad you enjoy them. Did we get a new one soon? Did not have one since last year. It's. We haven't, ha yeah, we haven't had a new lore video since last year. That's very true. Um. <laughs> These people are vultures. My God. Uh, oh, Altar of Rights, right over here. Um, so no lore video, no no lore video planned soon. So not sure when the next one is gonna be. Um. Get that move speed, huh? Fine, let's do it. Boom. What does that need? So there's any class specific six piece set. Ah, yeah, six piece set helm. Okay. <coughs> I got one of them. Give up my extra Enos. Yeah, I'm going to turn one in real quick, and then I'll be probably good. I think I'm switched over officially. Oh, I can do that, too. How come I don't have the... Oh, it's those things. Okay. No, that's fine. Yeah, I was about to say, that's what I'm on as the Ubers or whatever. Let's see if we can break GR60. Oh, easily. I'm hoping I'm set up proper. I think I'm missing something. So the altar is the same. It's just slightly nerfed. Like, the skills are somewhat nerfed. Ow. Uh, I don't think I ever played Killing Floor. If I did, maybe it was a little bit when it was new, but I, uh... Killing Floor was fun. I enjoyed that game. Tell me about it. I uh, just waves of, uh, enemies coming at you. And it sounds like the kind of game that I would play. Shooter, uh, just, yeah, waves of enemies. It's been a while since I played. Like horror, right? Yeah, they were like, yeah, you know, fucking creation zombies, uh... Yeah. More dark. Yeah. That is not yet I used to be into like Unreal Tournament stuff back in the day, so it feel, feels like it would have been up my alley back then. Oh, is there a thing right here actually? No, there's not. Yeah. I'm just going down. 
Conduit Shrine in here. Uh, I'm gonna pop it since we're over 50% done. Yeah. It cannot be done. Feel the wrath of Yitar. My understanding grows. My strength has increased. And a speed shrine. Huh. <laughs> That's what we needed. We're not going fast enough. Started playing Trabs of Midgard again. Oh, nice. Didn't really enjoy that launch, but it's in a much better state now. That's good to hear. Warlock, I'm doing well. How are you? Anthony is spinning us a tale of woe. Oh, no. Your new 2.5k monitor has been having issues from day one. Spent a week trying to troubleshoot it. They go back to try and get an exchange or refund. Was told they have to reproduce the fault, even though I showed them photos of it. Week later, asked for an update. Two days later, crickets. Went to the store and was told they started testing it yesterday. Asked for a bag so I can send it back to the manufacturer myself. Was told, no, sorry, it's not here. What? Where is it? Where is it? I was like, it's gone into witness protection. <laughs> I am returning to town. Oh boy. It's at the warranty center and they don't work weekends, so it closed and locked. Try not to rage. Jeez. Oh, sorry to hear that, Anthony. That is, uh. Oof. My strength has increased. Ah, oh, dang it. I didn't get back in time. I had to spend uh, blood churns. Yeah. It's all good though. I cannot afford that. More potions. Oh hey, I got one of those petrified screams. Oh. Uh did I give you a restraint? Yeah, I gave you a restraint, not a focus, right? Uh let me see. Yes, correct. Okay, I got another restraint if anybody wants it. Oh, uh, I can't remember. Gotcha. I'm good. Okay. I just looked and I was like, oh, I haven't seen what I need for uh, Impale build for a while. It's like, oh, you need Compass Rose and Traveler's Pledge. I was like, oh, I haven't had that have that for a while. I need to do one thing real quick. Be good to go. I was saying I was heavily against D4 since release, but trying season two with the ability to skip the woke campaign. Woke? I can finally say I'm enjoying the improvements to the gameplay, not D3, but fun. Alright. Alright, should be good. On up saying the visual contrast between this and Diablo 4 is staggering. Yeah, there's a lot of color here. Many colors. Tribes of Midgard. I might have played Tribes of Midgard. Oh. Are we out? Uh, yeah, we're out. You can It said you cancelled. Oh, wait, do we all need... Gra yeah, we all need Greater yeah. Rift Keys. Is that what's happening? Yeah. I don't have a, I don't have a key. Ah, okay. Alrighty, well, I mean, at that point, we're, we are... We are. It is It is. Uh, 12.30, so we'll probably call there for the night. Maybe I'm going to play on Monday. I don't know. Should I play on Monday? <laughs> you sound like... Okay. I don't want to say it, but you sound like an addict, dude. Like... <laughs> Monday will yeah, be the my last, last time we. This is my last time. <laughs> I mean, maybe I could play Monday. I don't think it'd be that <laughs> big of a problem. Real this it's, time, uh, you know, I, just, just, just just one more time. Why are you itching your neck? Just one more time. Just one more time. <laughs> one, one more, more. Uh, that's all I need. One more hit. Oh, uh, one more, one more. <laughs> Who knows, Mas? All right. Well, yeah, we'll be calling it there for the night. I'm uh, gonna finish up the news video for uh, tomorrow morning. Uh, if you didn't see it, folks, yesterday I put out tearless video. Uh, for this season of D3. Um, today, earlier today, I put out a video about the last Epoch trade system. The details on that were unveiled yesterday. And again, tomorrow, news video. So, we're going to thank everybody for coming on by today. We're going to thank our mods for overseeing things. We're going to thank those who joined us in game for our season start. We're going to thank everybody for watching. We're going to wish you a fantastic weekend. We hope you get to enjoy some Diablo 3. And uh, until next time. Bye-bye.